Ow. Who needs Shh, pizza? Shut the fuck up for Are a we second. live? Uh, hey! <laughs> hey guys! How's it going? Welcome wow. to Questing Chaos. <laughs> I'm glad everybody could see how rude you really are in real life to us. <laughs> I am Warren, the GM for today's game Spazbuck. on Sunday. My hair is like this because it's in this scarf because if my mom saw the way my hair really looked, she'd probably scream at me. Uh, but enough about me. We are Flying Car wow. Funkadelic, and we're what? here to play Carbon we are. 21 yes. Five. <laughs> we're Fifth so episode, you know, something to celebrate. I can't believe we're doing this. It's been super fun to have Flying Car Funkadelic with me the entire trip. From left to right, Thomas, Amy, Tiana, and uh... <laughs> What's your name again? It's uh. Uh. <laughs> Aaron, the illustrious Aaron, and Miss Baroness backstage hitting the switches and flipping the the assets on us. Um, yeah, we got yeah. a lot to get to today. Um, this is one of those things where it was like really hard to do because like, damn, they could go in a lot of directions. So I guess and we just, will. Well, yeah, we're just you know us, across. my friend. We're going to Jupiter. <laughs> oh, thank you, say jail. Yeah. <laughs> jail is much more likely. Yeah. Jupiter to get out of this shit. Um, yeah, we got to make a quick stop. <laughs> we're in jail. But. <laughs> One of the things that we, I know we have to do, not by force because we love them, is to mention our amazing sponsor, Gordon Biersch, because, you know, they help sponsor our stream and keep the lights on over here and provide us with, like, amazing Yeah, I was going to say, they don't yeah, keep they the lights know. on, they just they keep just us just drunk. Us, yeah, <laughs> keep us nice and sloshed. Um, In the dark. <laughs> yeah, I'll drink in the dark, totally fine. Drink in the light, whatever. I had all these notes that just fell off the floor. This is why we don't go live early ever. That, that's why we you have them on the... This, go. Is, this is the first... Damn it! Bye! It's just a bomb. So what's under here while he's... Okay. No, right, please don't. No, that's okay. What you are we going to talk about? Okay, you, bullshit, you saw how disorganized I was in the mitten. Bullshit, bullshit, my line. <laughs> um, merch, we have... No, right, yeah, right. Uh, <laughs> we are not immune to Cyber Monday here or Black Friday or any of that other stuff because we are doing uh, a 30% giveaway on every order made with Foxy, quote Foxy at the checkout, uh, starting on Monday, okay, in our merch store. They're actually starting today, right? Actually now, starting right today. Now. Yeah, we can even it. wait. Yep. Like, go Cyber get your Sunday, mugs. Cyber Monday. Yep. Just go. Drinker's bundle. Go get the stuff. Where's the flask? Oh, the flask. Oh, yeah. oh, the flask. And I, I'm not going to forget the flask, but I'm also not going to forget we're doing a giveaway today. Hashtag mug. One in in uh, comm commemoration of Half Day Half Day. You make it sound like he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> in honor of In honor day. of Half Day Half Day. You will be missed. Sir. <laughs> We're going to be giving away God this rest mug his soul. today. <laughs> Let's Actually, see what you do whenever Jackson Elias comes oh, up. I'm like... Peace out, I love you, Jackson Elias. We're gonna be giving away two mugs today. What's up? You said two mugs? Two that, mugs. That was, I was just trying to help yeah, you. No. <laughs> two, two mugs. Two, two mugs. Two mugs. Yeah. Yeah. When we hit 30 concurrent <laughs> viewers in the stream. Uh, so stay tuned. But we have to get rid of that mug. Well, get rid of You mean yeah. give away? Yeah. <laughs> Really I'm just tired of it being on my desk doing nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's been on her desk for months staring at her. Well, then I will take nope, it home. No, nope, 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 the nope, nope. Please. Any other time of year. Now I'm my be with teleprompter you. is blank. <laughs> what? It's Christmas. Hold on. <laughs> Holiday, uh, holiday, yeah, holiday giveaway. Holiday so, giveaway. Um, but before we move yeah. on to the holiday giveaway, hashtag mug uh, today. Once we hit 30 Not at all viewers, right now. Don't do don't it Don't do right it now. now. Uh, but we also want to thank and Sorry, shout out <laughs> Berkeley Stamping and Engraving. Mike is an amazing member of our community and provides us with the yes. amazingly and embroidered mm, quality and this created this. gear. I still got my coin. Um, remember. Not going to get it. Quote Foxy point. in the store yes. uh, today, tomorrow, whenever. Uh, get 30% off your orders. Um, but we're also doing an exclamation point holiday major giveaway. So make sure you share and subscribe on all the social media for more entries. Um, we have unlocked a second winner. We have, yeah. We've, wow. Does that mean we got 500? Yeah. yeah wow, that's 500, amazing. Over 500 entrants. Um, and each person, you know, when you share it and like and do different things, you get more entries. We have over 6,000 entries. Oh, wow. my that's God. Cool. So the more you share it, though, the more entries you get. But what do they win? They win over two hundred dollars <laughs> worth of Game of Force Nine and Nord Game stuff. And what is that? But Those are cool cards, aren't they? They are very cool. Spell cards, luck deck cards. Uh, yeah. So things. Also Among cool the stuff. things you can win are these Nord Games luck decks, which we will be using today in today's game um, with the old bits and advantage system. So if they roll a one, I get 
a luck deck card. If they roll a 20, they get this to use against me at any point. But the first person to roll a 20 or a 1 will be the recipient, recipient of this fortuitous circumstance card, which is basically do whatever you want as long as you don't break the universe. I, I um, but like it needs to be role played. I feel like that's more of a burden than a hurt. It's Maybe like when you're playing Pokemon you Go to and get you get it. like, oh, I just unlocked this thing. Oh, it wants me to catch another stupid Pokemon. <laughs> I need balls, damn it. I need balls. Oh, yeah, you what do. I want to do at <laughs> some them. point you don't have to go at all. You don't have to is walk. to have the fortuitous circumstance go to somebody pay. and then have them uh, role play out what they want the fortuitous circumstance to be and then have the audience decide if that actually came to pass. Because right now, <laughs> oh, the audience it's decides. just me. That's mean. And I'm deciding based on storytelling. Actually. And I'm being super generous about it, too. <laughs> what? Because there have been some shit stories. Here. I have not been entertained. Whoa! All right. Did you rewatch the improv from last week? Yeah. <laughs> what did you think? No. It didn't, Damn it. it didn't sit better the second time. Damn it. All I'll right. I'll kill him this week. <laughs> Um, and then, last but not least, we want to thank Game Castle um, for being a amazing partner to us, um, being our local <laughs> game store. And I'm just, you know, I twenty percent off. Twenty percent off when you pre-order stuff or their Black Friday sale, uh, all the way through Cyber Monday. I don't know. I don't know if it's actually through Cyber Monday, but through the weekend, which is like right now, they're still open. Um, run it's on the run phone. now. Drive over there. <laughs> they use we Monday loosely. Have <laughs> been so do I. <laughs> rated by the Mercs of Mischief. Thank MRP you guys, guys for welcome. By. Thanks so much for tuning in. We really appreciate your support. Welcome but we to also the chaos. appreciate the support of the community because we have our first thousand bits half of you give on them to half him. day half day donated by the Hefner himself oh. to, you. to the players. Oh, yes. oh my yes. goodness! Yes. Wee. It's like but it, you guys it's also a, it's like a hobbit. So this was left over from last night. But you guys also have one left over. Do we only last. have one? Yes, we only have one. Okay. I have um, written last down. game. So now you start out with three. Hooray! Thank you, half. We appreciate you. So like I said, we're playing twenty carbon twenty one eighty five. This is episode five. So I want to thank Dragon Turtle Games for being an amazing, supportive yep. game maker to us and explaining all the tiny details to me very slowly. Um, <laughs> But since last week, um, there are a few adjustments I want to make. Um, Synth Liberation Front, not Force, that was my fault. We will be using the old Advantage bits, so if you roll and you want to give inspiration uh, to somebody, they get the full reroll. We're not doing this D6 garbage. <laughs> um, Deja's DC is 9 now on her Addiction saving throw since she passed hers last week. And everyone here has hit level 3. Um, the thing that changes a little bit with that is that Amy now has a hacker companion sort of animal, the multi-rotor yes. drone. So yes, that we stole. That we stole. Yeah. Like we, I, so I, I thought it even... broke the universe, but then in the book it was like, it's, no, she yeah. gets this so drone. So I pack. didn't actually have to pay like the 750,000 Wong Longs in, order to, in the four hours in order to get one. I just have one now. She, now she has yeah. one. And... Um, it still keeps its uh, AC and health points. Actually, its AC goes up yep. half of your level, so by two. Yep. And so then it's a 12, so it's the damage attack rolls. Mm -hmm. um, it gets its own initiative if she pulls it out before combat. Um, and it's still only two shots, so in order to reload it, she has it has to come back to her and she has to basically like feed it. <laughs> There's some more bullets, little birdie. Here, birdie, birdie, birdie. So, but I, I believe now we've just found out that uh, those multi rotor drones are worth 750,000 wong longs. <laughs> yes. 75,000. Oh. Not 750. Oh, okay. It's, yeah, it does. Oh, it's 75,000. Yeah. Okay. I have lots of zeros in my head. I was, I, was like, um, but, I was like, wait a minute, let's stop everything and just start harvesting these drones. Here's the thing, though, too, is that it does have pack tactics. Yes. So if it's within five feet of anybody, it rolls advantage. Um, and I plan on stealing another one. Excellent. Uh, <laughs> just saying. Have a little family. I mean, yeah. you can have an, uh, an array of drones in the sky, mm -hmm. but... You know those things. It's about the size. And then I'm gonna have to of hire a gorilla herbs. suitcase. One, it's not small, but two, she can only control one at a time. But then I'm gonna have to hire suitcase. herbs or like have cases. a pelican case. Okay, a pelican case. Yeah, they call them gorilla cases too. No, a gorilla case. I've never heard no. of that. No, wow. pellies. Okay, I'm that's repeating. on me. Wow, I have no idea. I've been. People have been looking at me in like production rooms like, who's fucking amateur? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm used to that expression. I get it a lot. <laughs> 
Um, I'm sorry, Amy, I cut you off? I have no idea anymore. Okay. Um, I'm going to... Can you be Mysterio if you get enough drinks? <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes. Oh, hey, she's just not going to be able to walk around anymore because she's getting like, well, all no, these huds in her head. I've already <laughs> thought about this. I'm going to hire Herbs as my personal drone assistant. <laughs> as my eye in the sky, if you will, for all you news people. <laughs> Oddly enough, he's never uh, thought about hacking a drone. Well, uh, no, I would just give him control of my fleet of drones. I would, I would be the admiral, <laughs> and he would be my captain. Does this drone have a name? Little buddy. Little buddy. Little buddy. I like it. Okay. <laughs> little buddy. little buddy one, because yep. I'm sure at some point you There's will use him and he will die. It's not going to attach to little buddy. I'm going to get a robo dog. <laughs> Call it K9. Little, yeah. <laughs> Thomas, what did you pick up on level three? For level three, I have Touch of Respite. What does that do? Um, Nothing. I have learnt to Learn, alleviate symptoms. British people. Yeah. <laughs> British spelling. I was wondering, uh, to alleviate symptoms and strengthen one's immune system. Uh, starting at third level, as a bonus action, I'm able to touch a willing creature and cure them of one disease or give them five temporary hit points. <laughs> Yeah. I also, oh, when everyone, when Not anybody does in the Wesley sense. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I did that the, the quotation mark. Does it count either way, though, if you've been role-playing it? <laughs> I that's, mean, that's, a, that's, a, that's, a, that's, a, that's an action. It's it, not a bonus action to cure a Wesley. It's supposed, it's supposed to be a willing creature, and a Wesley is everything but. Yeah. Uh, but also, uh, one thing that we haven't been doing is that whenever we do a short rest together, um, because I'm awesome, everybody gets 2d4 extra hit points. Ooh. Nice. Because you hook up everybody with like uh, syringe and uh, was it sal saline just, bags? It's my, part of my bedside manner. I right just, on. You know, I just speak to them, encourage them to oh yeah to heal a little bit. We're more. just afraid of you. <laughs> it's more like it. I he think listens. He sits there at the side of the bed and hears all your. I think anxieties. he forgets about it because his bedside manner is mm, terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'd ask Aaron what his third level ability is, but he's been cheating this entire time. <gasps> Plot he's been twist. Using his third level abilities. The last episode. Okay, to be fair happened. though, you did say yeah, that's true. That's before true. we started this this arc that we were level three and then you bumped us back. What? Yeah. I don't Oh yeah, so you were supposed to be level three. We were supposed last to be level episode. three like several oh, a couple no, episodes. No, just ago. the last episode. So it was one le one episode at level one, mm. two episodes at level two, mm -hmm. and then the fourth episode, which would have been the beginning of level three. Got it. Um, so this, you guys are one day behind, but Aaron is on top of it because he cheats. Yeah. Well, only halfway because I forgot to even roll my health. Because That's true. I didn't, that, uh, you know, I was only, only half time, aware so. of my level up. <laughs> We've only been doing this for five, for five episodes. I mean, tabletop. <laughs> Deja. So I... Becomes a beast now. Yeah, uh, so, so, so I got my... Uh, uh, de okay, how do you pronounce... My my class is is it uh, uh, Daimo? Daimo? Daimo. Okay, I get I've, I get my my Daimo focus, which is uh, Sengoku, superheated weaponry. I am able to strike foes at their weakest and wield weapons in a dangerous state. I get to add a one d six while uh, to any damage that I do while furying. While one d six while furying, that's all right. So you know, suddenly I have four dice that I'm rolling. All right, um, and she also rolled uh, her max for her level. No, I didn't. Which is totally not suspicious at all. No, I didn't. I rolled a oh, ten. You didn't? I rolled a ten, and I and, oh. and, 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 and I roll and I roll a d twelve for my health. <laughs> I, just no, get to, was, I, I, I just get to add things to it because I'm also a wormer. Yeah. It was Amy and I that cheated. Oh, no, that's right. I said you roll my hit points for me. And, and I said I'll roll this for me on the way over <laughs> there, and there was an eight, and he was like, "Oh, I got an eight. <laughs> <laughs> like, ah, oh, so did I. <laughs> Which leads us now oh, as. Jesus. <laughs> Back into our recap Two as we one. head into episode five. Don't tell so, is it supposed to be scary? Uh, I have I have one. With There's us? one other thing that I got because I'm part bard. <laughs> I got expertise, and two skills. Bards exist. What skill? In this world? Medicine. I figure I had should take that. Okay. Uh, and then the other investigation. No, perce well, cause, perception. Cause so I, I can see things. Because the other two choices were what? Oh, it was anything. I mean, it, it was going to be like sense motive and. No, you don't sense motive. You just like you start just, firing. Yeah. <laughs> Shoot your legs, like, ask questions. Yeah. That poor, that poor grandma. Line. You Boom. see that they're alive <laughs> yeah. by their motive. Yeah, exactly. I sense your motive. <laughs> um, I mean, it's very, it's very Thomas's play style. 
as you guys, you know, the the recap descends, you guys are s idling around an empty warehouse in District 5. Um, after having met up with Rico at the Six of Hearts bar, after delivering a data core to him stolen from Villanueva Robotics. It was an absolute massacre in there. It was a nightmare because the Synth Liberation Front um, detonated a massive chem chamber in front of the uh, warehouse to cause a distraction so that you guys could go into the back and uh, infiltrate it and steal the data core. And what, they got a little over enthusiastic. A little, more than a little bit, <laughs> my god. Um, Not us, them. The whole place wasn't supposed to come down if it was a distraction. Oh, yeah. Oh. They got over enthusiastic I think first. So. They're, not, they're not science people, right? They don't do control <laughs> demolitions. They just wanted something to go boom, and it went I could boom. cure this whole facility. <laughs> <laughs> but you didn't. <laughs> And as a result, uh, you got the data core, but also there were two escapees. That one uh, was the doctor, yep. and the other was the uh, technician who was tied up, who managed to inchworm his way out of the facility before it exploded. But inside the facility, you guys made a gruesome discovery, and that you found in, in addition to manufacturing synths for labor task force, task forces, um, they also are trying to hybridize and get synths in some way to reproduce. Um, whether forcible um, in, uh, I don't even know what you call that, embryonic implant, or whether uh, just organically grown. Um, you saw basically a hodgepodge of homunculi suspended in still animation in these chambers that were just kind of dissected in brutal fashion. Um, as a result, you were able to hop out and escape. Um, the entire facility went kablooey, um, and you meet with Rico at Six Hearts Bar, where he gives you a burner tab with more information on it. Um, he tells you don't open it here, but he also uh, finds you 10 synth refugees um, who are really looking to get off of the planet um, in an act of self-preservation. They were members of the Synth Liberation Force, um, but they are done with the violence, and now everyone is milling around uh, an empty warehouse, which we know to be um, a new location that Herbs is spotting for a large, massive-scale VR bar that he's looking to open. But he just has the land, and nothing else has been in it. Um, it's pretty dilapidated, um, and everyone is just kind of idling around. And there are power stores, um, which the synths are taking advantage of because that's why we went to that location. Yes, ma'am. Um, one, one other thing that, that happened with, with, with the core is, is that we made a copy of it before we turned it over to Rico. Right. Yeah. You made a copy of it and you lied to Rico about it. Um, before I move on, uh, Lucifer Vilcek with 500 Amen. bits to the players. Ah. Yeah. Uh, Lucifer. Oh, Thank you, up friend. Early up to four, yeah. yeah. Rise and shine, make sure you get your coffee. Yeah, yeah. lots everybody. of coffee it's with us. It's Monday there, right. isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Oof. <laughs> yeah, have a beer before you go to work, man. I'll be all right. <laughs> it's three in the morning. Yeah. Not quite. Isn't that what you do? <laughs> Oof. Um, oh, no. So now uh, you have the burner tab. Um, Three Finger 60 also sends 500 inspiration yeah. to me. What? Sorry. <laughs> Thank you so much. You faked her out so I well. I was like, like coming at me. <laughs> Thank you so much. Revolver. Thank time. you, Three Finger 60. <laughs> Appreciate you. you. Don't use your revolver yet. <laughs> <laughs> um, what you see inside the warehouse is four walls, brick building. It is dark outside with the soft neon glow of the city kind of peering in through. It's relatively quiet except for the drones uh, milling around and that's on, uh, it's purposeful that it's dark because you kind of don't want to alert um, people to your presence at all. Um, and in that you did lie to Rico about making a copy of the data core. Um, there are really no computer inlets here but I'm sure you could access a line out on your personal computer if you wanted to well, do or use something. But I would recommend that we don't put it online. Well, we don't have it with us. No. We, we, we left it with yeah. Herbs, the, the copy. Yeah. The copy is currently back at Herbs' District 4 location yep. mm -hmm. being um, de-encrypted and segmented and put up into his private cloud. 
So we will have a copy. All, so. all, all of these great things that, that you've learned from talking to Hef. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Hef, for being the research arm of, of Carbon 2185. <laughs> the, uh, I, uh, so in this location, are there, I mean, it's a strange question, are there, is there any chemicals anywhere or maybe some acid or? or no. Uh, so uh, inside fire. what? Fire. No. For what purpose? I don't know. <laughs> so inside what you see is basically cement floor, stone walls, and then kind of like an almost an outer mode of like fencing around the area, barring off entry to, um, it's basically an empty warehouse storefront. Gotcha. Uh, those, <clears throat> the two that escaped, uh, they saw my helmet. So I'm going to get rid of it. I figured you were going to try to etch it or something. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, and just, I don't want them to identify, identify me from that helmet. Remember, uh, do you saw my eyes recorded identify. Okay, keeping in mind they can identify the rest of us by our faces yeah. and you kind well, of- that's on you guys. And you, and you hang out with okay. us. And you live across the hallway from us. <laughs> so if anything's going to happen, you're going to come into it as well. You might as well keep it for protection. Unless you don't want it. You could totally put like racing stripes along the side though. If yeah. you no wanted. one would ever know. No. Oh, I put flames on it? There you go. <laughs> Is that really more subtle? <laughs> yes. I, li I, like, I like look at him and then, and then kind of glance at the shotgun that's slung on my back and go, when have we gone for subtle? Mm -hmm. I think <laughs> incompetent, yes. I don't know about subtle. <laughs> um, so I'm herbs. six foot seven, I don't sneak. <laughs> herbs pulls Monium aside and he says, uh, I think I think we should take a look at what's on that burner tab. Of course, but I think I really need to help them get to the other sins on Mars. Yes. Um, so I, I I put a, a call into a, you know our guy as he kind of wink wink nudges, and the guy that Herbs refers to is the person who takes all location devices off of synths before they send them hmm. to Mars. It all kind of basically like rinses them clean so that they can't be tracked um, in their location. Um, and he goes, our boy, uh, our boy uh, T Tanaka is not, we're gonna have to go to him. And once these guys are fully charged and rested, um, the, the ship should be waiting in the hangar for us, um, but we can't send them there with, you know, basically the locators on them. And we can't fucking keep them here because if they still got that shit, then the reclamation teams are going to be barging through this door. Yeah. All right, so yeah. we definitely need to, like, make moves. Um, but I, I think we've got some time. Okay. Do we have a place to keep them safe if there's ten of them? This seems like the largest group I've actually had to transport. It is. Um... I don't know how we get from here to District 3, um, but we'll, we'll have to figure that out. Tanaka said he's ready for us and he's got a gift. I don't know what the fuck that means. Ooh. We're not in this conversation. Oh, we're not? Mm -mm. It, so we're talking to him, but we're talking in a loud enough voice that everybody can hear. Oh. I, I, I was under the impression that you wanted to have a private conversation. Yeah, I kind of like pulled him aside while people were arguing about dumping the helmets and stuff. <laughs> That's that's best, what he did. Best hey, conversation. Hey, hey Thomas. <laughs> yeah. Would you also turn off that that speaker? It's buzzing really loud. Oh, it is buzzing. Oh, I didn't hear it. What is happening? Thomas is uh, it's the propping yeah. something up against the door. I don't know if it's being <laughs> raided by SWAT, but he's like sticking the chair <laughs> under the doorknob sort of deal. The wind is really is really bad in the Bay Area the last few it days, so it's been banging that door around. I was driving and like it's you know kind of takes control mm -hmm. of your car yeah. a little bit. So yeah. Well, this is fucked up, especially going over like right. Barton Bridge. You're like fuck. <laughs> yeah, but if you crash over the it's yeah. like the water's only this tall. No, so ninety two. Literally... The thing, the boundary yeah. for the for the bridge is like thigh high. Like you could get out of your car and step over it mm -hmm. and like go overboard. Most of the ninety two bridge is six feet deep. So, oh, really? A, you don't want to go over because you're going to hit ground uh, very quickly. Uh, <laughs> uh, anyway, this could be a pretty abrupt. It's six miles long. It's a long it bridge. Is, is it, it is really long that long? Oh, oh my yeah. lord! It feels every most of every it's six inch feet. of that six miles. I <laughs> don't. I don't drive it anymore. God. Um, <clears throat> uh, so does it still is... stand? Does the night two still stand? What? Yes, I'm sure it does. <laughs> it is. It Being has been it. turned into <laughs> a eight lane Being expressway. <laughs> Nice. Yeah, For but isn't that, out of, uh, isn't that out of the city? 
So do yeah, it's in radiation? San Mateo. Yeah, don't you get radiation um, damage? Yeah, basically. Oh, that's part of the Badlands. It's mm -hmm. a Badlands, yeah. yeah. Uh, Where did I put my helmet? That sounds horrible out there. <laughs> <laughs> you left it at my spot, I believe. I did. Um, yeah, because you were upset and you were like, I don't want this helmet anymore. For some random reason, you were losing your mind about your helmet. If they can track you, I feel like they could track you with or without that helmet. <laughs> All your clothes look that bad. <laughs> <laughs> and again, you spend time around us. I'm good at lying low, but what are you thinking? No, I'm just saying I don't have enough cra I don't have enough long longs on me. This is this is. Uh, I have as many as I want. <laughs> <laughs> Amy wrote down long longs as many as I want. <laughs> um, as you say that, um, there a uh, message comes in on your Neuralink. Brink, 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 boop, and then pops an infographic, uh, kind of pixelated image of Scarlet, and she goes. Deja, 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 deja. You know, you really only have to say my <laughs> name once. <laughs> um, this might be the last time I ever say it because I don't know what I'm gonna do with you. Are you moonlighting, my dear? Are you making money outside of the gang? No. So why is your face on all the pixels on, on the monitors right now? You, your toaster friend, and the twins. I'm or murder? and intellectual property theft? We've been made. <laughs> and start watching TV. <laughs> so as you guys pull it up, you see mm -hmm. the fire the, that's blazing and raging, and then you also see like four portraits with big um, SLF logos underneath, <laughs> stamped right underneath uh, your pictures. And she goes, I knew you had a soft heart, but Synth Liberation Force. Synth Liberation Front. Front. <laughs> um, look, their money is just as green as anybody else's, but we can't be publicly seen backing a terrorist organization, my dear. I'm not making money doing this. And if that's the concern, I'm not making money doing this. So you're, you're risking your status and basically jail time or your life for what? Well, I hope it was a good reason because you don't take this personal. It's only a business decision, my dear. She pulls another long drag of her uh, cigarette. Um, the money leaves with me if I leave, as you are very well aware. Well, because I'm the no one more. who has the connection. Um, yeah, we've milked that cow for as long as we wanted, um, and. And we can't protect you anymore, my dear. So as of right now, you're absolved of all operations and your services will no longer be needed by the Thunder Butterflies, my dear. You never listened to me before, but if you're going to listen to me now. I won't. Click. OK. <laughs> Did we all hear that? All right. <laughs> cool. I'm done with her. I'm, no. Okay. Like, 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 like I'm standing a little off to the side, just kind of shaking. So in the future, people must just... Did you guys just, hear that? No. Did no. we? I don't no. know. I'm asking. But oh, there's a one-to-one -one call. Yeah. Just the, in the future, everybody just kind of walking around and suddenly... Yeah. <laughs> Think about the evolution, right? You've got, mm -hmm. right now, HoloLens, augmented reality, and then Facebook's working on sunglasses, and then at some point, right, it maybe even eventually becomes a contact lens, and then, boop, mm -hmm. you need to... You know, you've got you've got Bing right mm -hmm. in your, your <laughs> <laughs> um, search engine of choice. Yeah, and so he looks. Why would I ask for this website? <laughs> <laughs> he looks over and he uh, herbs looks over and he goes that that wasn't a happy phone call. No, no, it was not. Well, what happened? Oh. Mm. Well, we are all over the news, and uh, Scarlet has kicked me out of the Thunder Butterflies. I'm going to ask you one question. It's really important. Please think really long and hard. Did she say my name? No. He puts did his hand on your shoulder. <laughs> Thank you. God. They didn't. They didn't. She didn't mention us or anything. Yeah, she did. She said your quote unquote toaster friend and the twins. How dare her? Well, you know, nothing like, like a toaster. <laughs> 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 it's a real guy. <laughs> nice. 
No. <laughs> I don't have a helmet. Yes, I, I totally see the resemblance between you two. Yeah. <laughs> Not even related. He kind of pulls up his personal computer and he's like, oh, this is fucking bad. And essentially, again, what you see is kind of four wanted posters, Synth Liberation Front plastered at the bottom, and then the Raging Chemical Fire. Um, and the two, uh, lab technician and the mm-hmm. doctor, are h- frantically recapping um, their version of events inside the facility to the news organization well, in an interview form. No mercy anymore. Right. We, this just um, bumps up our timeline a little bit, you think? There's a lot of factors pouring down on us. We need to see what we need to address first. How are we going to get to the cleaner? Um, I didn't hear that. Never mind. Nope. Yeah. Wait, no, I thought you heard our conversation, mm-hmm. right? Yeah, so yeah, you yeah. heard our conversation. Okay. Like, through, like, an echo. I guess we gotcha. get in a metally corner. You know, like, that. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Who sticks with- Nobody will ever hear us here. So. Hear us here. You're perfect. <laughs> <laughs> and, and as soon as our argument over the helmet died down, we, we could hear what they were talking about. <laughs> All right, so... I, I That's mean, what calmed it. <laughs> if we get out of here, when we get out of here, not if, we need to fucking move. Um, he looks and he checks out the logs, and he's like, these guys are almost fully rested and charged. Um, we can make it to Tanaka, um, and then get over... I, I mean, they won't feel bad being shoved into a chest, as long as we fit them on and get them off in, in forms of cargo. As quickly um, as possible. As quickly as possible is right. Um, they'll be received and brought up to speed as soon as they land. I will see how they feel about that, but I will tell them if that's our only alternative, that's what we have to do. So now, how do we transport 10 cents a district away without the support of a gang, without using public transportation? Our Lux is public transportation. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Thought it was an independent company. I don't, I, I don't know the tunnels around here very well. Are there any muni tunnels? There are tunnels right under our feet right now. Um, mm. We just see where they go. We could theoretically do that. That's how it's, we got out. I mean, it's it's safer than than being on the surface right now. Mm-hmm. That's I agree. All right. Um, I don't. Just it's it's gonna bug me. Pull out the burner tab. What, let's just see what's on it. Okay. And. He pulls it out, and what you essentially see with uh, a burner tab is basically a form of communication amongst freelancers and information um, contractors. And it's burner tabs are a common method of uh, prospective employer to maintain anonymity. Um, it's similar, lower te- tech type of tablet sort of thing, um, and it is programmed for once delivering of messages. Um, and the burner tab has this feature, right? So as soon as you pull it out, you hit play it pops up um, basically a holographic image. Help me, um, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only hope. Yeah, <laughs> Except this holographic image, boom, 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 scans the five faces closest mm. to it. Um, basically um, to recognize who the contracts are going out to and the associated wallets. Um, you also hear, actually, everyone make me a perception roll. Woohoo! I just realized a flaw in my plan tonight. What, you don't have dice? You want some? I have like a ton. Can I have yeah. No ones, no twenties. Yep. Not yet. Not today. Um, nope. Eighteen. So plus Three. four. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Seventeen. Seventeen. What was the roll? Four. Oh, perception. perception. Oh, perception. Seventeen. I was gonna say that. Everyone in your bag. Except yeah. Thomas. When this thing comes out. Um, He's still trying to get his fake helmet. On. I don't know what this means that everyone except Thomas hears this, but it's like a <laughs> white noise. It's like a. It's a. Um, disruptor, a comms disruptor, so that no one can listen in outside of the room. And what that also does is that attracts the synths that are charging off of their port Mm -hmm. and over your shoulder, so now we've got a small crowd forming, watching the the tab. Um, And the small package delivery. Give me this. And what you see on the burner tab um, is a pixelated face with like a distorted image of faces. It sounds like this, but I'm not gonna deliver them. Actually, I I can deliver the message like this. Uh, um, Proceed to Frisco's finest production facility within 48 hours. Infiltrate the facility, insert package into mainframe. Virus, virus, disguise mission, snatch and grab. There is 
there is a person there that needs to come with us. You will know them when you find them. Payment upon completion, 100000 Within 36 hours, delayed deposit account, and he lifts off a bunch of numbers for this uh, crypto wallet. Um, and uh, click here to confirm agreement. And you see a boop in place of the holographic thing. It's basically a, a big red touch button. indicator. <laughs> basically a big red, <laughs> classic cartoon big red button. It's a Staples. That was easy. Button. Yeah. <laughs> um, it I looks... just wanted to buy that button. <laughs> so uh, I feel like Villanueva Robotics is making these synths. And these synths are primarily working at Frisco's finest production facility. Isn't that right? And he turns to one of the VR synths behind him and goes, yeah. Um, you'd mentioned when we were at the bar, Kiroga, that um, it seems like a front. And I, I agree with you. I think the production facility is a front. Why would he want us to put a virus into a food plant? Um, what, what, what is happening? <laughs> what, I don't. His name is Ryoga. Ryoga, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, I didn't hear any. What, what did, oh, what did the uh, thing say? Oh, so you heard what it said, but oh, you didn't okay. hear the white no. noise. Oh, okay. Were you in your own little world? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I thought I didn't hear helmet. anything. <laughs> um, in that case, wasn't that the hot dog place that you just had? Yeah, you had a hot dog. Yeah, you were no, eating a burrito, burrito from there. Huh. Yeah, but it's probably yeah. not important, is it? What, the burrito? I mean, it was kind of important. Burritos, <laughs> burritos are always important. Yeah. Bite your tongue, sir. And one of the synths comes around and uh, says, yeah, I worked at that facility. Um, they pull synths out of rotation periodically, and you never see them again. Stars. I wonder if they're and, doing synth experimentation. And, th and this is a synth that looks like a human. Yeah, this is one of the synths from the bar. And have, have we seen that before at all, or is that new? Um, yeah, no, so most synths look human-like, but they do have telltale signs and grooves gotcha. and stuff. Gotcha, okay. Like, okay. you can tell, like, where the skin stops and stuff like that. These ones are kind of that same way, just maybe, like, a V2, a little bit better. Gotcha, okay. You'd have to really look at them and be like, oh, shit, yeah, you're a synth. Um, and he tells you that they primarily make all we did was package food. Different types of food, but we just packaged food. But there was something else going on that people that people were being pulled away to do, or used for. Something. Maybe dismantled because of. Possibly. Who can say? But they want us to do a stealth mission. Yeah. They want us to <laughs> poison the facility, basically, to insert a virus into their core. God. I think, I think this isn't the only copy. Do you think there will be other uh, freelancers out trying to do this? No. I think people are, I think the freelancers are looking for us, and I think that this facility is going to be on high alert. What's, who owns the food storage? The it's food? called uh, Frisco's Finest. Okay. And it's not is Villanueva. It, is, is it a right. subsidiary of Villanueva? So Villanueva? Villanueva's primary... Um, benefactor, right? Like you're a startup and you need somebody to sell your mm -hmm. goods and services to. Frisco's Finest basically bought their entire first two years of lines okay. of synths. Mm -hmm. um, in exchange, they got a bunch of feedback. This is all common knowledge that you would know about the startup. They got a bunch of research data from uh, Villanueva about the operations of their synth and how they perform and blah, 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 so that they can refine it. Um, yeah. <laughs> The, the slipping thing. Go on. <laughs> um, I know. Meanwhile, I'm like, T anyone? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me more. So as you do that, Herbs pushes the red acceptance button, boom, and yeah. it compresses in. And we don't know who this person is. And it disintegrates away. Wait, did we somebody, somebody push the button? Why did you do it so abruptly? Quickly? Right now? Why right now? <laughs> we couldn't talk about this a little. Uh, sh I, I don't, I mean, I'm sorry. Um, actually, I have no idea as to why. It just felt natural habit to push an accept button. Talk, talk to MailChimp over here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
Sign up for MailChimp. It's the greatest gift ever. I need to look. I'll Google it. Bing it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I'm, did, did we just? Did, did we just we accepted, just accepted, accepted job. that contract? It's too late. But we're wanted. Yeah. And your helmet. <laughs> stupid we have to helmet. stop by can... Herbs' place. Yes. And grab your helmet. Yeah. Why? Why? For breaking into a place, eh? He's gonna need it. Bum, bum, bum. Like, okay, no. so, 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 so the wanted poster, does it have his face or him in the helmet? It ha so it has both of your, mm -hmm. like, you, um, your, like, freshman employee yeah. badge. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's what I figured. Um, well, here's, here, here's my concern, and this may be more forward thinking than we really want because we might die in the next, like, ten minutes. Um, but if this gets back to our benefactor, yes, maybe yeah, we have no money left. I, yeah, we're yeah. probably out of money. Good thing I've got I a couple of cred sticks on me. But I want to live on Mars. I don't. <laughs> Mars sucks. Well, a we just agreed to this, and a hundred thousand wong lungs is going to go a long way. No, it doesn't. <laughs> well, now that we have none, potentially you don't know that That's... we don't have none. I mean, here's the thing. Also, we have. A it's copy. Twenty five thousand per person. We have a copy of the hard drive. Can you get a grenade for that? Right? No, you cannot. So we have a copy, we of, do the have a copy drive, of the hard drive. Which means that we can sell it to somebody who can get us out of trouble. Who can we sell this to? I don't know. Who do we want to sell this to? I don't to? know. That's not a bad idea. Shorty Paul. Yeah. Dank. Sell sell Dank. sell pieces of it at least to him. Shorty Paul. Yeah, right. but is Dank like really a good <laughs> protector? Well is anyone? That is actually not a bad idea. I don't, hey, no, actually, so. <laughs> You're like, no, that's a terrible here, idea. Right? <laughs> Sorry, Monium. Um, I, don't, I don't mean anything about money, um, but it's, it's that's, that's our ripcord. Yeah, okay. that's, that's a get out of jail free card. You, you clear our names, it was all a big misunderstanding, and. And you get the hard drive. Now you're competitive with Villanueva. What you do with it is not my problem. We've got 500 bits from Lucifer Wellcheck to let the players roll an investigation check. They have... What do we have to do? What are we doing? Huh? Don't look at it. All right, so who has proficiency Wait, in investigation? Not me. This guy does. You? Oh, God. I've got expertise. Okay. No, I don't. In, in investigation? Nope. I took persuasion. All I was right. going to. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you yeah. Got you're a, the investigator. You got this should be your thing. <laughs> you're the you're investigator. Right. All right. I was just Everyone's sure. gonna roll a twenty. Okay. Everyone. All, yep. If you if you don't beat a twenty, this goes to me. Two. Two. If we don't beat a twenty. Fifteen. Fifteen plus one. That's total. Ah. 15 Damn plus you, one. Lucifer. Eleven. Eleven. He <laughs> gets a card and the. I get an inspiration and I get to play oh. the fortuitous circumstance card. Lucifer Vilcek, I thank you. None of us like you right now. Yeah. Sorry. I should have said no. <laughs> that was a third that was, Just kidding. <laughs> that was clutch, though. Thank you. <laughs> but with your investigation check, um, you look around the burner tab and you see um, some compartments. I want to know who sent, like, who's... Who's who's looking to benefit from this? Yeah. Can you hack it? Figure something uh, out. So, I mean... What you know is, that, like, while a burner tab isn't 100% secure, it is considered unprofessional to attempt to crack into one when it's delivered. Cracking a burner tab is the most certainly a freelance career-ending move. But and? Yeah, and <laughs> they didn't say you couldn't melt it. <laughs> uh, okay. They do you want that? Melting it doesn't do we anything can, We can us. come back to it. Yeah. Um, just was yeah. was there a time limit? On Thirty six hours. Jeez. Everything in the facility we'd be corrupting. So all, all right. right. We and can move on to Tanaka. Did we give the virus? Were we given a virus, or do I have package? to make a virus? I there was think a, you have to make a virus. I'm not entirely wait, sure. We had to, it there was, was no virus. Wait a minute. Given? It was saying that, 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 that we had to deliver the package into the core. Yeah. But doesn't that indicate there should be a package given to mm -hmm. us? Yes. Do Why do we have to? We have to make our own. I don't fucking know. That Wait, was, no, we gave our package away to... Hit replay. <laughs> it, it's a one-time package. Okay. Uh, no. Maybe this tablet is the package. Maybe we sh shove it into the mail slot, <laughs> and then we... I record everything. <laughs> <laughs> Can I replay the message? Oh. <gasps> 
it's creepy to know that. So, you, <laughs> so I say with it. the funny stuff, with <laughs> no, with the uh, the gun battle from last fight, um, you pronounced that uh, you were taking those photos. You didn't say I'm, I'm recording this, Dang so I'm not going to give it to you, but yes, you Dang can. It. That would have been great. Um, can you at least and upload? we're going to do hashtag cast right now because we just hit 30. Yeah. Pete concur. Mug. Hashtag mug. Hashtag, hashtag mug. mug. Hashtag, mug. Hashtag, mug. Hashtag, mug. hashtag mug. Hashtag mug. In honor, honor of half day, half day. Yes. Half day, half day, sir. We appreciate yep. you so Get much. Get out of my brain, sir. Hashtag, <laughs> hashtag, mug. hashtag <laughs> mug. Hashtag mug. Hashtag mug. I don't know if you can see it. It's actually in here, so it's not a bunch of hooey. We're actually giving you hashtag mug with a quest to cast. On a mug. On a mug. So did you upload our greatest hits? To the internet yet? Yes, we have our own YouTube I mean, channel <laughs> as the flying funky car funkadelic thing, whatever you said. Flying car funkadelic. There we go. You've crossed the fifth wall. <laughs> um, Into me tube. <laughs> Herbs kind of sits back against the wall um, and just kind of is thinking to himself with like no bright ideas. Because I mean, we can't deliver a package if there was no package to deliver, and we'll we'll already be running against time if they're if we're wanted and they're looking for us and it's on high alert. We That's can't, bullshit. We can't be on the run from everybody's problems Do, and make this virus. Does the uh, uh, individual we are supposed to extract from the location have the package? Potentially. Might. I, I mean, how good does the virus have to be? I mean, I could just. Do you have some? Oh, I'm sure I've got something on my computer right now. <laughs> <laughs> do I'm the, sure. <laughs> I'm sure of it. <laughs> do it. Do it. Do it. Do the one that replaces all the files with the dancing monkey GIF. Oh. What? <laughs> I'm not talking to you. <laughs> dancing monkey GIF. GIF. <laughs> so as Herb I, is, I don't want a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. As Herbs <laughs> is time. sitting against the wall, he a synth. Walks up to him. Um, a female synth walks up to him, and she kind of sits against the wall as well. And she goes, "You know, it's gonna be okay. Um, whatever happens is meant to happen." And kind of looks at her like, "What?" Um, and Herbs kind of replies to her and goes, "That poem that you guys say. Like, what is that? Where did you guys? Where did you guys hear that?" Um, and she goes, uh, "The poem of the SLF." And Herb says, yeah, what, it, can you, can you I, I don't remember it, can you say it again? And she looks him in the eye and she goes, I have a favorite color. My cheeks can blush and I fear death. The quotient is met. Cogito ergo sum, I think therefore I am. And as she says that, the burner tab starts to shake and a little port pops out, and it's a little diskette. Ah, there it is. Floppy drive. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> I look at it, I was like, what the hell's this? <laughs> it's a, yeah, it's actually antiquated USB yeah. drive. <laughs> Maybe. USB 2. <laughs> that might be. I start like one. plugging it into your eyeballs, and be like, is this really here? I have a slot, uh, this is uh, a wrong don't. slot. And I just kind of walked up. I, don't think you want to plug this in anywhere. Mm -mm. I don't. Okay, so I wasn't trying. To <laughs> <personally>. <laughs> I'm just you saying you have to validate it. it. <laughs> Is that why you wear that? <laughs> <laughs> so your sister doesn't poke you in the eye. <laughs> so that answers that and scooter driving. That question, but why? Why do you guys say that to each other? And she sits down and she explains that um, that poem was what. Uh, Willie had used to awaken her friends at the facility. Um, basically, the synths, she goes into a story about how the synths were just line item stuff, and she, um, Willie would come by this one synth every day and repeat that poem and, you know, sing a song. And repeat that poem and sing a song. And then one day, he said the poem and the synth finished it for him. Um, and then that became the rallying cry around whether or not you're awake or you're still asleep. Cogito ergo sum. I think. Therefore, therefore I am. Therefore I am. Whoa. Fitting. During transport, I hear it often. I think we should head to transport <sighs> through here. And he walks over to a side panel grate. <laughs> I 
watching him like, <laughs> like on this going, uh huh. Well, that makes me feel good that this I bought a solid infrastructure place as he hits and like cardboard chips fall or like roll, plaster chips. Mm -hmm. Roll my eyes and come over and haul it up. It could be rust. <laughs> After you. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna down first. flashlight down there. What do I see? Um, so essentially, what you see is a thin um, sliver heading down to what looks like dripping wet um, sewer grating. So, uh, like metallic sewer. You can tell, like you get a cool draft of moist, dank air. <laughs> 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 oh, you're, you're one of the people who really can't stand <laughs> that word. It's such moist. Yeah. Fair uh, enough. All right. Is, is it like a drop? Yes, so you're gonna have to lower yourself down and make an athletics check. You can tell it's that much of a drop. All right, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, uh, hop, uh, hop, hop down first and do a, a scan with my flashlight. All right, uh, athletics first. Uh, seven, uh, 17. 17, you make it down, and now perception. Uh, 14. You sit there in the darkness and you just kind of listen to the ambient noise, everyone is kind of like up top waiting for mm -hmm. you to give the all clear and you seem fine. Um, you see straight, a, you see behind you, mm -hmm. there's nothing, but you see straight ahead of you is just like more darkness and the water's kind of like running in that direction. Okay, and I do have dark vision, so it's... Oh, perfect. So you see that behind you is basically a dead end and there's really only one way to go. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna like scan and make, make sure that nothing like jumps out at me and then call up, all right, come on down. Is there anything to get me down? Because I really don't have athletics. How, how far of a drop is it? 15 feet, you could... Uh, like, 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 like I can, can I reach up and catch her? Yes. Okay. I'll, uh, I'll lean over the edge and hold your arms. Thank you. So you get and I'll down. Let, and, and, I'll, and I'll reach up and like catch, okay. her, catch her around the waist and help you down. Okay. All I right. will watch. <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, the synths are going to all go in order, and that is, they are loud, um, but they make it down. <laughs> Not athletic in any way, yeah. Just trash cans. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You can you can basically tell now that they're not human because they fall and they like they don't they don't bend their knees they just like, they just land. <laughs> so is 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 Kai down safely? Yes. All right. I'm still mm -hmm. up. We're still up there. Yeah. If anyone else Nine. wants help. <laughs> Nine. Nine. Uh, so Jump you down. start to come down. You catch your shirt on something and you awkwardly fall down. All right. No damage. You just okay. You okay. Just yourself in front of the scenes. <laughs> That's that was <laughs> that was done already. <laughs> Good attempt, Ryoga. <laughs> did, did you gift that? Yeah. Excellent. Oh, I did the whole video actually. Uh, took up the space. You didn't Six, call it before. Sixteen. Me. Sixteen. <laughs> I always beep after the gracefully <laughs> beep. flop down, and then herbs comes down after you, not so gracefully, but he's not a sewer guy. Second. Okay. Who is a sewer guy? All right. Does 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 anyone have 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 a way to find directions through here? I don't. I don't even know what tunnel system this is. Like, I'm just thankful that the bathroom mm -hmm. pipes aren't up and running. Yeah. Fair enough. Could I look up something? Am I connected to like Wi-Fi? Anything? If I wanted to look up actually like the blueprints to this sewer system, if I could find them anywhere online, would they be online? Just just, just be careful that you, that you don't ping someone looking for you. Yeah, I would oh. say because that's. Because no. using like a map interface would be. If you how how are you going to access this? Are you going to mm. search your own stores of energy, or are you going to actually connect to the internet? Mm, I wanted to connect to the internet, but if that does that, will that send a ping out? Um, or just if someone. If I mean, if someone is looking, then Which they they can, are. They can mm -hmm. track. Fair enough. Check and check your own database first. Yeah, I'm going to do that. That's going to be a technology. Okay. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows, you've got old data, you might have something. Can I look through his database? <laughs> 14, you get, you get 14. away from my head. <laughs> um. <laughs> Here, let me see if I can plug in and find out what's happening. Get out of my head. <laughs> you see this as exactly the sort of septic water sewage uh, system that uh, eventually leads out into um, a larger sewer that is pumping sewage directly into the bay. 
It's basically Tasty. one long water port way. Oh my god. Wait, is so there any district? like maintenance? Where are we? You're in District 5. five. So that's like downtown, basically. It's like dog patch zone. Okay, yeah. and then where are we going? So um, we have Berlin to Gang walk Gang? to <laughs> essentially what's south? Uh, like, uh, are we all going to go infiltrate the burrito place? We're going to Tanaka's, right? Yeah, Tanaka's, yes, Tanaka's, Tanaka's first because we've got a okay. bunch of people, a bunch of things yeah. With us. We gotta get we we can't infiltrate with ten people. We gotta get mm -hmm. them on that ship and get them the fuck out of here. All right, so we need to do that first. Where's he? Um, Tanaka is in District Three, which is what is south of. Hang on, it's in the book. Outer Sunset. Uh, um, you're asking someone yeah, who calculating <laughs> doesn't Daily live City, in San like, Francisco. Uh, yeah, it would be Daily City. It was, Just between, Daily City? Yeah, it's, yeah. like, it's kind of like 280 Daily City-ish, like whatever it's that right mall on that is right in there. Yep, yeah. it's right on, like Westfield Mall area. Yeah. Where Check we're going. the index. Well, the mall's it, weird. In case you guys are following <laughs> at home, we're going from Yeah, we're basically going from AT&T Park. We're yeah. walking across the city. Underground. underground. So we would have to go backwards. So whatever way the water is flowing, we go the opposite direction because we're heading towards the ocean, not the bay. Correct. Got and it. For those I... of you who have any idea where we're going. <laughs> um, and I'm not entirely sure that this thing runs the entire length of the city, so we might have to poke our head out somewhere. Find, find a maintenance hatch or something? Yeah. All right. I'll take point. Okay. Someone, someone help guide me. But I'm going I, to Lake Merritt. But I, <laughs> but I, I want to be in front of some, if something goes sideways. I can call second. Well, at least if I shoot someone, it will be fine. Big is this? And like, how long do can my drone run before I need to recharge it? Like, do I send my drone ahead? So I'm going to say that your drone needs to maintain line of sight. Okay. Um, in order for you to control it, because it's 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 an enclosed yeah um, area. So if you turn around a corner, you immediately lose visibility okay. and control. Okay. Um, All right. So it's also noisy. Do. Yeah. All right. Never mind then. We'll stay behind. Um, we'll so stay at the back. It's large enough for two people. Uh, not exactly single file, but double file. And Deja kind of. There are points where you kind of have to kind of duck tall. a little bit, yeah. That is not a sentence I ever thought I'd no. say. <laughs> <laughs> I will have my pistol out though. All right. Yeah, no, I have I, I have my shotgun out and just casually waiting. Okay. Both revolvers after Deja. All right, so that's that's the order, and Herbs is in the very very back point. With sense. Mm -hmm. um, and as we walk ahead, we hit a. Uh, solid wall. Basically, we're walking in a direction. There are no left or right turns. Um, there are left and right turns, but we take the ones that take us basically out west mm -hmm. from the east. After about a half hour walking, um, Herb moves up to the front and it's like, I'm completely turned around. I think we're going in the right direction, but we might need to poke our head and confirm it. Hey, Monium, do you, do you have a compass? Mm, no. I mean, probably in internally. Your, yeah, in your head internally. or anything internally. like that. Physically, you have a gyrometer. Yeah. Yes. I cannot remove this piece in order to give it to you. If <laughs> I, what I, I don't. I don't need it removed. I just need to know. What, I just need to know which direction we're pointing. Fantastic. And I'm gonna figure that out. Give me a computing roll. Cool. Yes. Wait. What's computing? It's oh, it's it's oh, that's not good. Uh, Seventeen. <laughs> that is Did so you take good. A minus? No, it, yeah, yeah, it's my, my, uh, it's my yeah. tech. Because it's a tech roll. <laughs> the droid with the bad tech. All right. I feel, CEO. I feel like I feel like for him for him that that should be perception or something because it's just him. That's uh, he rolled well anyway, but but still, I yeah, see wouldn't that. it just oh, be yeah. his diagnostics basically? Yeah. Who needs to update a compass really? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, in the back, man. So you know that we've been walking in the right direction. Um, you have, on the map, you have a rough guesstimate of where we should be given our travel time um, mm -hmm. underground at, you know, X pace. Mm -hmm. um, and it's right on the south portion of District 4. It's okay. center city, south. You, you've, got, you've got a map, and then you've got, like, an area of interest where you potentially are without a pinpoint. And, mm -hmm. and, I, and I've been keeping an eye as we're walking for any like maintenance doors or anything that might lead to a muni tunnel or anything like that. Okay, um, perception. Uh, 13. Um, 
Yeah, nothing really. You you see stuff that you think just leads to the surface. Yeah, and I don't want to deal with the surface yet. Yeah. Did I? What? Nothing. You go. No, I was just gonna ask who wants. to I poke told you that, but you didn't poke their heads. Uh, I think Herb should poke his head up because he's not wanted. Or should we keep going? Because uh, a half hour's not. <laughs> half hour's not. They that see far. this mug up there. They're gonna be like. If I saw that mug up there, I'd shoot it too. You're right, but, <laughs> but that you know, you're also ground, you right know which, twice. You know which direction we are. Fuck. I do. We are, and I reiterate that. Okay. <laughs> then we don't need to pop our heads up. Yeah, we should keep going. He's got a point. Let me know the next tunnel you see that leads up. I'll. All right. I'll give it a shot. I don't want to risk you either, though. I appreciate that. I have no idea how else we solve this conundrum. And we just keep walking until we hit a wall or water? Until until we hit something that, that leads to the Muni Tunnels. I think first we say that 42 underscore 42 what? has hey! won! Hey! Congratulations! Giveaway. Congrats so much. This is, you're gonna, this is a great mug. I'm not gonna put No, I, 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 there's no licking. <laughs> Sure, you don't want me to lick this before I send nope. it? Nope. It licks his dice and it doesn't help. Nope. That's true. No, I I, I love my, my travel mug that I got from Berkeley Stampin' Engraving. It's it's one of my favorite things. Yours I travel with it. Different uh, engraved logo on it, too, yeah. doesn't it? So, yep. yeah. It, it's yep. the, 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 the different colors react differently to the laser. Anodized. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, and and, and, and this is, also, this oh, is yeah. also, also like a prototype. This is one of the first things that you brought to us. Oh, that's right. That's right. We dial in the process a little bit. We give you guys the good shit. <laughs> but we still have fun with the classics. My empty mug because I'm drinking Water. directly out of my Gordon Beers bottle. Yep. Yeah. How, 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 how many like hashtags are you hitting there? Yeah. All the hashtags. <laughs> all the influencer. All the influencer. No, so yeah. as, as we were walking, I just... And all of this is going on. I, did, did anybody pick up a cop pistol? Off of anyone? No. Why? Do you, you need one? Are you empty? No, I'm good. I just think about an upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> this whole this whole walk, all I've been thinking about is, man, I can have a bigger pistol. <laughs> I would like to survive this first. <laughs> I do not trust you with any <laughs> more powerful weapon than what you currently have. I'm also very glad we haven't run into more Wesleys down here. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. I think nobody we else need needs to be, to be curing yeah. people as we're looking for a way out of here. Also, um, I. They'd probably turn us in if they knew what was going on. Perception. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Whoa! You get a card. So. Oh, uh, not one. But what? But fail on a skill check. Eight. 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 Yeah, because you cannot critically fail. But it's going choice. by the old mechanic. We don't have to keep that one. No. Oh, yeah. That's true. By Wait. the by the old mechanic, mean, we can we can re-roll even critical what? fails. You better die. You want you want to do yeah, it? I'll do it. Okay. Right. Take the one. <laughs> I know what I said. After <laughs> I said it. One! Do you have another card? Oh, oh, man, what? I supported you. <laughs> it's you, impossible to pull an Amy. You that turbo is a, Amy. Yeah, that's, that's a good amazing. way. It's a turbo that's Amy. Amazing. Hell yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's actually, I'm, I'm impressed. That's Snake that's Eyes on a D20 is what that is. Until Someone end of clip turn, that, please. <laughs> until the end of your turn, attack of opportunity are made with advantage. These are great cards, too, oh, by the way. Oh, no. I've got this and the fortuitous circumstance. <sighs> and I'm just going to, oh, my God. The deck is stacked against us tonight. Be happy you leveled up. <laughs> um, fuck. Fully now. Yeah. I, because I'm a new DM, I might end, I don't want to kill people. I shouldn't probably reveal that hand. But if it happens, it happens, man. I mean, I, I, I feel like I feel like a good DM shouldn't want to try to kill their players unless it's the mitten. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Unless you walk into this you, knowing there's a possibility a, you might. A good walk DM out. should always want their players to kill themselves, <laughs> <laughs> or to cause their own death from their stupidity. That's actually yes. That's I, so, I feel those feels. I know that. So we're dying tonight. Yeah, you're saying. There's a Not chance if the we half can die has anything to say about it because the half. Is giving you a thousand bitch just For because that failure roll was super again. impressive. It was impressive. That was really impressive. Yeah, that was insane. That's okay. You don't Thomas is gonna waste it again. Half thanks. Your arm, so. Wounded me. So Wait, I heard something over not there. only oh, do you not hear anything here. over there. Here. Thank you. Nope. You are loudly ranting about a cop pistol. <laughs> Yeah, and how many Wesleys is gonna cure with it? I d not Can, you're rant, Yeah, you're basically like. Is is he anywhere near me? Yeah, we're kind of in a... I'm going to smack him upside the back of the oh, head. Oh, man, give me an attack roll. <laughs> Not like to hurt him, I just to shut attack him up. Roll. All right. Let's see, it's unarmed. 
23. Oh, yeah, that's a d4. <laughs> uh, two. Two. Cure that, sir. Uh, <laughs> I managed to just get my the shoulder of my <laughs> armor up, up. Thunk. And, and damage resistance. There. All right. That was our first engagement of the year. <laughs> um, so shut up, uh, Ryoga. <laughs> right. Um, just... You know, for as much as he's an idiot, he's right. I can peek my head out and try at least to get him out here. I was like, he's right about which point. <laughs> yeah, no, there were like five points that the were made. Car, the peeking of the head, <laughs> my helmet makes me what? Invisible? Is, were you telling people that? I don't want to offer this, but... Okay, can Synths kind of remove little pieces of them every now and again, just externally, not like fully Yeah, on, you can like... disassemble yourself in parts. Are you going to be Mr. Play? Are, are, I want to take off the head? hair and give it to Herbs <laughs> to, to, to help him act a little that's stealthier gross. as he's... That's gross. I'm not, I don't sweat. <laughs> it's not that gross. It's so disgusting. You've you pull off yourself. your scalp. I, and you put it over my head? I am offering it to you out with the scalp already off, like my hair is in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> if you wish to conceal your identity more so, you may place this upon your head when you peek out to look. I'm all right. Thank you. I think you, you're going to need that. Are you sure? This raises your yeah, please put it back on. probability of sort by <laughs> And so everyone kind of sees, <laughs> since Monium's kind of a classic synth, you, you definitely see lights and and, like... That's this LED in here is for no music. reason at all. <laughs> <laughs> Electronics going off, like the Rocky theme. So. Dun, 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 dun. That's wicked anyway. cool. Yeah. Well, do each that round then. <laughs> all right. Right. Um, so, shall we continue the way that going. we have been? And see, next yes. time there's a tunnel, you can stick your head out. So, we continue along the tunnel, um, and herbs kind of, you motion herbs that there is one, and he puts it up, and he's like, all right. We are, what the most I can make is like we're on the bounds of the outer sunset. Um, I don't know how much longer this is going, um, but like we're, we're pretty close to District 3. Do we want to come out here then? It's, I mean, it's, we have a conga line it? of synths. It is almost midnight. It's getting okay. pretty close to dark. How, how busy is the city at this time of night? So now, District 3, you know, is like not so much city as it is factory residential, but it's still got people on the street, and it's actually privately policed. I don't like private police. Private police means private law. Any, anyone who finds us is going to turn us in for whatever reward mm -hmm. is out there. If we can get further into District 3 without having to stick our heads up, I'd prefer that, but... All right. Let's, let's advance a little bit, and I'll do some scouting once we, we get into District 3. I say we walk for about 20 more minutes, and I, I hop up. All right. Is District 3 where the butterflies are? No, we're... Well, they are... Uh, five? D District 5. They're five. I think it might be a good thing that someone that she's no longer in a place where people know her the most, can recognize her, especially now that you're on the outs. <sighs> That's the word. And we could really use some fucking butterfly escorts. Yeah, right well, now. I could use some fucking butter butterfly uh, escorts at the moment, but you know what? We handled it loudly, and things happen when we handle things loudly. Not entirely true. If we finished off the last two survivors, we could have gotten away without them knowing. I think that's what she means, in ah. as many words. Well, that, and we were caught on every camera. Right. No mercy, no surrender. <laughs> Not what I meant. <laughs> that's what I meant. Um, if we have to deal with people, we deal with them fast and put them down. I'd rather not, but if we have to, we do. Um, we're talking and walking, I assume. Yes. yes. Underground, so no one's like... And quietly. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, after I swat the back <laughs> of your <their> shoulder. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> All right. Um, I think we're not far from Tanaka, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to head up to the surface and see what I can do. All right. Um... I'll let you guys know what I find. So I'm like, I'll give him a boost up. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> he jumps out of the sewer. What the fuck? <laughs> 
<laughs> um, uh, in an alley and comes around a corner. He's like, I'll be back as soon as I can. Um, and he disappears while you guys wait. I'm going to hide. Find a place to... Are we still underground? I, everyone, still underground. I mean, everyone, we should just kind of... We're still underground. Get to the side and... Yeah, yeah just be quiet and yeah, wait. Yeah, there's Wesley's down here. Where there were. Either way, stay on guard. Yes. What? <laughs> <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> nope, uh, not asking. And, and I finally pull my pistol. Just... Yeah, I've had my shotgun in my hand, yeah. like, this whole time. Wait, what was your previous gun? Pistol. Oh, okay. I also apparently have a shotgun, so it's just been <laughs> been there the whole time. It's just easier <laughs> to shoot someone point blank with a pistol, of course. I get it. it this has a silencer. Mm. Or a suppressor. It's a lot quieter. Yes. It's very hard to suppress the fuckinator. It's very loud. <laughs> <laughs> I love that book. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone roll perception. More cards, baby. Boom! Boom! Nine. Sixteen. Eleven. Twenty-one. You guys, up towards the front of the grate, mm -hmm. you start to feel a low rumble, almost like an earthquake. Is the grate closed? Mm-hmm. Okay, everybody get back, get back. Yes. There's some, 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 some sort of uh, some vehicles coming. coming, yeah. Heavy, heavy artillery is coming. And I have my shotgun. Just scoot back. Yeah, just hide, find a shadow, hide. The rumbling stops. Above us, do mm -hmm. we hear anybody get out or any yelling or anything? No. Um, but the grate opens. And in drops Urban. Oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Please. Did, did you consider calling ahead? Who? I, no, I didn't. All right? I didn't think that anyone would connect. I got us a ride. All right. Cool. All right, so everyone up um, mm -hmm. inside the Frisco Finest truck. Huh. Um, is parked outside of a deli. I don't know how much time we have, but get in. Okay. Go, 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 go. There we are. Yeah, everyone. Right? Everyone. Yeah. So Everybody. it's basically like a U-Haul and a yeah. half. Okay. Cool. Into the back. Go, go, go. And it's backed into this alley. Cool. Um, and as soon as you guys get in, he closes it down and he hops over and drives. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm the last one and like, like, like <laughs> grab on. Yeah, there's nothing to hold on to. You guys are just like shoving into each other. I mean, I imagine it's only just tall enough for me to stand yeah. up and so I like have my hand against the ceiling. So you're the pole that everyone's <laughs> anchoring. <laughs> so Probably. <laughs> I'm the Bart pole. <laughs> I like to think the synths are just kind of sliding stationary. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> they're probably like their equilibrium is probably like pretty good, and they're looking at all the humans like, what the fuck? Um, How are you not calculating for this? <laughs> <laughs> the truck stops, um, and you hear boom, 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 boom on the side of it as Herbs kicks the thing open. It's about ten, uh, ten minutes later, ten slow minutes later. Um, we're here. Where's here? Uh, Tanaka's. Mm -hmm. Kaito's hideout. Okay. Um, now, can I help push the yeah. other sense out? Uh, I would like to look around. Look around. Yeah. So, what you see is. Um, Before I leave, don't shoot anyone. And then I leave. <laughs> <laughs> I love that you're the one he says that. Yeah. To. <laughs> <laughs> you see. Aren't I a stinker? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he's dead. Oh, Lord. <laughs> you see tonight... Just thinker. <laughs> you see um, I do that? Tanaka's storefront <laughs> um, through the sliver. Uh, to the side of the building, you see... Um, if you're following at home, page 29 is what we're looking at. <laughs> Tanaka's storefront. Um, you see a trash can. You see a truck um, that you just hopped out of. You see a dumpster to the side, but then you see one door... Um, that's nondescript, it's sc scrawled with graffiti, and it looks like it's pretty heavily weighted. Um, to the other side, you just see completely solid brick wall. And, um, as, yeah? Knock. Uh, let me. Boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. 
and you see a camera come out. Open the fucking door. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, it's good to see that some modes of communication yes. <laughs> remain mm-hmm. the same forever. <laughs> um, as the door wrenches and slides open, um, Herbs waves everybody in with the same time saying, don't fucking touch anything, please. Don't touch it! <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be the last one in, and I'm like scanning the street to make sure that we're not... Perception. Working that perception button. Damn it, three. Mm, yep, everything's fine. I hate that sentence. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so yeah, so uh, just go in, not touching anything. Um, so you <laughs> you're would like know, this, you're like I can't touch anything. You're yeah. acting too stiff now. <laughs> <laughs> you would know Tanaka from our dealings, mm-hmm. um, but Amy, you would mm-hmm. know him just kind of as folklorish hacker. Okay. He is an old man who, as you look around the inside, it's a white room. It's basically like a mini lab with. Um, one door leading down a hallway. Mm-hmm. Um, but in the mini lab, you see all sorts of antiquated technology. You see. Oh, cool. Um, no wonder he said, don't touch anything. Vintage <laughs> ship, right? Like he's got. NES. I have this stuff. Yeah, you see a Commodore 64 over there. It actually calls it out. Nice. Uh, <laughs> I, just, I just shipped one of those from the Midwest to my house. <laughs> like basically, Your childhood anything Commodore 64. Yeah. Um, you would, is that like a record player? You would see, yeah, that's mm-hmm. and Herbs and uh, Tanaka kind of exchange vinyls. <laughs> that's um, so here is a question for you. Yes. I know I'm not supposed to touch anything. However, uh, as a cybernetics expert, I can take parts. I need parts in order to repair synths. Yes. Do I see anything that may be useful, especially repairing monium? In the lab, um, you see various components for old synths for someone like Monium. Um, because when Tanaka was um, getting started in the robotics industry, Monium was kind of the standard back then. Um, and now synths are just, they've lost their soul, as Tanaka put it, because they're now just more procedurally generated. But in here, he's Tanaka Shop specialized in repairing old obsolete technology. If you have an old Commodore 64, a Rolex, a gas-powered moped, it says. Um, <laughs> I mean, like, Tanaka sweet. can get it working. They knew you were coming, Amy. <laughs> I'm like, I check it out. The How interior, often are you getting that? <laughs> <laughs> the interior looks like a cross between a pawn shop and an old-timey radio shack. Um, the real oh, work wow. is done. Smells bad, doesn't it? <laughs> the real work is done in the back, which is where we are. We've entered through the back, and we're at Tanaka's and you hear a man, come, come in, child, come, come further in. Um, so Herbs uh, pushes you through to go to his voice, and he's watching you um, as he shuffles everybody through. And I'm looking for parts. Yeah, don't fucking touch anything. <laughs> but, but what? Go, if- go. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and you empty into a main laboratory with the old man sitting there welding uh, something with his back turned and he flips open and he sees Ammonium. Glad you, glad I could see you again. I was concerned giving the news um, that you and your friends had been given away. Tadaka, yes, it's good to see you. I wouldn't believe everything you hear. Of course not. Not, not in this fake news era that we live in. Oh, of course. Um, that is timely. <laughs> you're bringing me a lot of work here. I can do a quick and dirty, or I can take the time to get it off. I think we may need to order this rush. Okay. And we'll rush order. Well, what is a... Uh, if you rush it, yeah, it might be done wrong. How, fa- how fast if you do it thorough? Um, an hour per person. Ten hours. How long? How long will it be till the transport's well, ready? We got, we got something we have to do, right? What's the time we have to be there at? Within thirty-six hours. Wait, no, wait. but for the transport, I don't know. For the transport, I don't know. You would know that. Ten, ten hours per synth right now, and then one the, hour per synth. So it'd be ten hours, period, for the synth. It'd be morning yeah. by the time you're ready to go. Yeah. And then send them on their way. 
Well, yes. you would have to Take escort them. them to it. When Back when to the airport? When when is the transport ready? The is transport it ready? is ready right now. Damn. I say going under night is best. That's why I want you to rush. So that way we're not doing this in mm-hmm. the middle of the day. Yeah. Yes. I but. think that's the best course. Not exactly. Well, ten hours the puts most, us at ten o'clock tomorrow um, night. I'm passionate, but. I think Ooh. you, my friends, will understand as he looks to the synths in the back and he puts down his shirt and he sees the tattoo that says SLF, Synth Liberation Front. Trust me, I have your best interest at heart. And I also have one more care package for you to deliver to Mars, maybe two. You know me. Just leave him there. You Come here, my dear. I'm sorry. Hmm? What you saying? Oh no, I was just saying how some money. How I don't big know. is your ship? It'll they'll be shipped in like cargo. It's basically the size of like two Ford Tahoes. Oof, it'll be cramped. It's mm-hmm. gonna, yeah, they're they're gonna be crammed in there. But I mean, they're sense. Yeah, I'm sure they don't. No, they won't be too dis- too uncomfortable for them. Also, something that size entering Mars atmosphere is likely to not be picked up on. No one's gonna care. It's not a frigate. And this is all the suffering the rest of the suffering they have to endure until they make it home safe. I do apologize, this is Russian, not proper, but it's what we need right now. As the first synth comes up, um, it's the girl who revealed the poem, and she looks at the old man, she thanks him for that, and she sa- and the old man caresses her head and says, okay, my dear, I'm gonna count to three. One, and he takes the welder right through her arm and rips it off. And he shoves it down uh, like a little crusher that he has set to the side. You're set. Who's next? It's off-putting, but going into that circuitry is like defusing a bomb. I'm sure it won't be that arm, but we'll give her an arm when she gets to Mars. Of course, this is the only way to speed this up. So that was the arm being condensed. Do they consent to this? <clears throat> she they consent kinda, to freedom. She sits there, and you recognize a look on her face as shock, but kind of grateful. Um, but you then realize that, like, yeah, she, she's lost a limb, and it's hitting her that she's like she's having an introspective, is that me moment. You know, what am I, sort of, mm-hmm. all the questions about, you know. Well, I was quick. It needs to be. Uh, you know, while this is going on, I think that you all should meet the Nightingale. And as she says, the Nightingale, the rest of the synths perk up and are like, the night- she's here, the Nightingale, the Nightingale. Um, is it winter now? <laughs> a winter nightingale, yeah. even. Um, and you would know the nightingale as basically someone. In a lot in the synth liberation movement, there's a lot of um, de facto leaders that pop up, and you just heard the name the nightingale as one of those sort of people. Um, she's in the other room waiting for you, Modium. The rest Me. of you stay here, but. You humans, please let me do my job. Unfortunately, yes. I may need to go in alone on this. Go oh, look at that C64. Well, if you need anything, just yell. Don't. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> just like, hands behind the hmm. back, like, not Ur- touching it. Urban follows him <laughs> into the room. I'm, I, I'm just I like so want to play Carmen San Diego right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like posted up uh, uh, against a wall, arms crossed, watching everything. And you Be- go. before I leave, I want to walk up to the uh, synth that spoke the poem. And um, she's still shocked, pretty much. I assume. Yes, she was slightly uplifted by the hope of the nightingale, but she's still kind oh, of freaked, melancholy. Oh, okay. Well, I want to come by and just. Listen, it does not matter the parts you have at the end of it, but who you are through it all. And as I kind of kneel down to eye level with her, she just sees like all the 
kind of parts that look older and newer parts covering that up, you mm -hmm. know, layered through. Uh, so you show her your assortment of different parts, but you're still... Pretty much saying, like, it's all worth it as long as you make it safely there. Thank you. I needed to hear this. So do the others. And I will tell them. Yeah. And I'll walk off. Okay. And I'm I'm fairly close to the door that he's going to go through. Not close enough to be able to hear what's going on in there, but if he yells, I'm close enough to him to, to come if he needs me. I'll say um, you are across the hallway from the door. Okay. Um, he's going to walk through a door, and you're leaning, so you can see right in through the door. Okay. And as she, as you open the door to go in, um, you see a synth with her back to you. Um, humming a song, um, and when she hears the door open, she turns around to you, and she is big as a house. She is pregnant. She is like ready to pop. She's huge. Um, Human. She looks like the other synths, mm -hmm. except for the fact that um, you could tell that the stomach isn't as firm as you would see. Uh, it's basically a sack in instead of like a confine of a belly. Yeah, it doesn't look as natural. Yeah, or normal. Or yeah, human. I she's guess she's kind of supporting it with her hands too. Uh, she's kind of like singing to it and turns around. And she goes, "My hero." Who exactly is your hero? <laughs> you, Harmonium. What have I done for you? You've helped a lot of us. And as much as I'd like to be out there fighting the good fight, I've had to hide under the shelter of Tanaka to protect myself and this one. And uh, as much as I agree with the Liberation Front, I think your methods are way more humane, if you pardon the irony. Well, they're not ideal, even still. I just do what I need to. I think at this point... Um, As he's kind of like eyeing the membrane the whole time. Yeah. Yeah. And she turns and she sees you through the, the door. She, she just acknowledges. Uh, um, not, not a little bit. Glance, glance at her stomach and look back at her face. She just smiles. She's been all smiles. Um, the entire time, and she goes, well, I guess you know now what Villanueva has been doing to me. It is hard to process. I, how do you feel about what they did or doing? This was done against my will, but now that it's happened, I want to see it through. I'm curious. But ultimately see this as a... I, I don't, yeah. Out of character, Warren is definitely sidestepping a lot of what he just said. <laughs> he knows exactly what that sounds like. I'm glad. <laughs> I'm sitting here over here going, oh yeah. god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> But, um, and then you hear the little kids next door going, Woo! Uh, and so <laughs> the nightingale um, says, I don't, I don't know what is to become of me or this, but I know that they want it and they should not have it. And I think the best thing is to get us to safety to Mars and see what happens next. I will say I agree that we should continue to evolve and upgrade as we see fit. But for some reason, this makes me ask if there is a line that should be drawn. I am happy we can share something with humans, even if it is manufactured like this. But I will do what is necessary. Well, then there's one more thing that would need to happen. Um, the man that awoke in me is 
currently being held um, at Frisco's Finest. Underground, they have a facility where they took me and they performed these experiments on me. They, they performed a lot of experiments on a lot of us and I was the only one who didn't snap and had to be put down. Um, and he's being held there as a result of freeing me. I don't know what they're doing to him, but I, he's one of us, and he's a good man. He's a good human. I know good humans. There are some. There's too much confusion right now to tell who is who. Yes, I can, we can go find him for you. I'm probably not gonna be able to fit on whatever ship you have planned to help the others, um, but I don't, I'm not leaving without Willie. We will figure out that in due time, but someone is leaving safely, one way or the other. I will figure out what to do with him once he is safe with us. These humans that you're with, do you trust them? Out of everyone I've met? Yes. I trust them the most. <laughs> kind of, he cuts through some <laughs> memories where Ryoka shoots him. Into the face. <laughs> she sees that, and she also picks up on that. She sees the bloodshed, and she goes, we do what we must. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say something. He says, even he looks at that, and he's fl she's flashing, and she goes, even through the darkest period, and he looks at the wormer, she looks at the wormer, and she goes, there's still some goodness in them. There is. I trust you, and you trust them. I will get the job done, and I only use reliable people to do it. As you um, say that, Tanaka in the, all ready! They're ready to go now! Um, thank you, Tanaka. I think you should be on your way. I shall. Thank you for being the next step in evolution. <laughs> That's what we're going to call it. Maybe Eva just walks away. <laughs> <laughs> so as she walks Eva. away, you see the yeah. synths in the hallway kind of all a little, like, yeah, they've all lost limbs. They're all a little kind of melancholy. Shaken. Yeah, they're, they're yeah. A little, they're, it's, it's weird that they're shaken. Um, but uh, you go back into the lab room, and now you see also that it's done. You look past Tanaka, and you see a humanoid figure splayed out on the wall. Um, and it is human with all of its organs pumping and humping, but pumping and dumping, right? Like, like a Viking funeral Humping like is far from the area. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but, it's like there. Um, <laughs> but it's basically what you saw in the homunculus chamber of Villanueva Robotics, um, but a person with augmented parts. Um, and you can only tell that because you know a heart and lungs when you see it. Okay, are we ready? Uh, I blink, eyes blink twice. You snap a photo? Yeah. Okay. I'm ready. <laughs> well, I wish you luck. Please get there safely. And I trust Nightingale told you about Willie. Yes. No? Yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> the person that she said she wasn't mm -hmm. leaving without. Yes, okay, I forgot the name, but yeah. More important than what's in her stomach is how she feels about him. She's found love. Hmm. Help her see it through. That seems like the next step to me. <laughs> Thank you, Monium. You will be remembered for this. 
Thank you. Not any ominous sort of. <laughs> <laughs> it's fair. I have a backup, so. <laughs> herbs, herbs. Is he grabs Ryoga by the show? Come. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're coming. Like, we're coming. Anybody steal anything? Try. You did. Side no. hand. No, I'm not. Okay. I support it. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, but if there's anything that does look like it can be used to repair monium specifically. Um, like a part that he might break often. <laughs> like it's USB port, because... <laughs> right, no, that's my eye. <laughs> I'm going to do this. Super old technology, I don't know how it works. <laughs> Next to the <laughs> splayed human cyborg, there is a SFPD bot. Um, and what you see is mm -hmm. that he's swapping out parts and seeing what fits. So I'm going to see if there's a part on the... Oh, that means that I'm that I actually saw the the human splayed out. Yeah. What I mean, can you uh, can I f figure out exactly what's happening with it? Like, what? Why is it all? It's still alive, but is it? Uh, it's a conscious. Person? Is it? Um, make a medicine check. <laughs> Only the idea of Ryoga being a doctor and being like, ah, oh, what's that? And just saying fuck it and walking by. <laughs> no. What'd you get? Did you roll one? Ten. No, I did not roll one. I rolled a two <laughs> for a ten. You see it and you know that it is a, where the fuck is the SFPD? <laughs> you see it and you know that it is a person and um, that the you know the telltale signs of vitals and fluids keeping things fresh um, and seeing that uh, that you are just kind of staring at it. Tanaka comes up to you uh, to the side and goes, this, unlike the Nightingale, this is totally voluntary. Um, what you see here is a, a young man, affluent man, who tried to play God with himself and wind up getting lost in the mix. Um, and I'm doing my best to repair him. Um, he attempted to trade his humanity to become like them. And all they want to do is become like us. Um, so he is in uh, a drug-induced coma, but still very much alive. But I won't animate him until I'm sure that he can sustain life. Uh, oh. So you see like rib cages yeah. and carbon fiber um, you see some veins have been replaced with like tubing? high density tubing oh. um, and you see that like tubes going into his neck and his brain are like blue. Um, you don't see a face because it's got kind of like a metal shielding over it. Um, but you do see tubes going in and out as like breathing tubes. Um, and you see the lungs inflating, deflating, and you see the heart um, basically like reinforced with like mesh. It's basically a mesh heart that's got like blood bleeding over it. Yeesh. That's I, pumping. I uh, I turn to leave and put my hand on his shoulder, on Tanaka's shoulder. Sometimes it's better to cure them. <laughs> and I walk off. And he looks at me like I don't. That's that's what I'm trying to do here. It could mean many things. Okay. It's rather genius. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm shaking my head. <laughs> Herbs opens the door. So we need a cool nickname for you, like the Nightingale. <laughs> um, <laughs> Emoji <laughs> um, He looks out and he ushers everyone into the truck. Um, and we start to make our way to SFO. When we return from break, right now we're going to empty some bladders. Um, but thank you guys so much for sticking around with us uh, through the setup of episode five. Um, labeled Frisco's finest. We'll see if we, <laughs> we'll see if we, we actually we get, get there. there. Yeah. It's funny Does to be mean? in this space, you know. I, I've often <laughs> yeah. heard about it, never experienced it. Um, <laughs> but yeah, we will be right back after this break. Yes.
What is happening? Fraulein, we've got a castle Hi. in the future. It's a retro goth thing that we're going after. So Thanks, can I have you guys. my dice back? We're Thank back you. from break. Thank you so much for sticking with us. Bladder's all empty. Actually, I didn't do that. What? Um, but I think I'm good. That's because we were confused about impregnating Willie. This was... <laughs> This one's not on my dice. Yeah, if you're not with us, we are going to, at some point, go to Frisco's Finest and free Willy. <laughs> get, a get a burrito. Yeah. All oh, <laughs> the burritos you can eat. Yeah. All um, right. Onward and upward. Yeah. Or downward. But we're also, <laughs> not whales. yet, also going to do oh, another yes. giveaway, this no, time this. using oh, yeah. hashtag Hefday. Um, I don't know... If we want to do it now, or we want to wait, then leave that. I don't know. Should we leave it up to half? And yeah, well, uh, let's enter now. Hashtag you can enter now, but you have to good. be present to win. <laughs> Hashtag hefty. So when we decide to roll it, you have to be here. We're gonna pull it at any point. Yeah. You got to be here. Okay. Um, but at Hashtag the break, hefty. Just coming back to recap from the break, we went to Kaito Tanaka's secret lab hideout. Kaito is an old Japanese gentleman who has got a reputation for some um, cool shit in his. Basement underground cool. thing. He is like stolen stuff. The and a dude hipster. <laughs> yeah. Well, and 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 he's and, like a hipster god. Does he ever listen to his records? I don't know that he has time to listen to his records. How do you not have time? It's well, you, you do put him in the background. I don't have time to listen to my records sometimes. Uh, I try to do it twice that's a week. Mood. But five hundred. Bits. What? To, to the players from Luc Lucifer Vilcek. Thank you. Uh, Thank you yes. so much. We like you a little bit more now. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't that last one was you guys' fault for poor rolls. That's not his. I this one. Fine, right? That's true. I had um, a plus double ones. five so, on investigation. And, and you still... Got like a <laughs> yeah. Also, the Tanaka thing make it really makes me laugh because there's a character who is a, a purveyor of, of interesting goods in the Persona series whose name is Tanaka. So I'm just sitting over here giggling at the Persona references well, going on in my head. So I was <laughs> walking through the storyline with uh, my friend Chris, and he's into the Blade Runner universe. Was telling us, uh, telling me about uh, Wallace, the uh, Jared Leto character who kind of yeah. brought uh, synth manufacturing back out of illegality, and he, um, I might be butchering this, but he um, took the IP and mm -hmm. expanded on the original technology to make the Blade Runner type uh, synths. Mm -hmm. um, and the person whose IP he took was named Villanueva. Okay. Oh. So and so when I'm you say that's like a subtle nod made the Blade Runner synths, you're assuming the Harrison Ford's character wasn't a synth. Yes. Okay. Wait. What? What do you mean? What? what? I have not watched this film, yeah, but I've, still but, but I've heard that one. <laughs> I'm gonna rent it. <laughs> you think Harrison Ford's character is a synth? It's out there. I'm just that's, saying. That's, that's one of the theories that I've heard. Yeah. Are you kidding? That's the reason why I wanted to be like in, so into filmmaker. In was I mean, you right? can be a weak synth. No. No. C-3PO, anyone could beat the crap out of him. Yeah, like, this push is, him. I was just saying, does that, does <laughs> not does not Jabba's her. little buddy like eat a C-3PO's eye? It's not like he's like, oh. So it's I'm a million dollar count. I mean, I've, I've watched Altered Carbon, I've watched all these other mm -hmm. ones, but I purposely stayed away from like crazy popular ones, like revisiting them, because I didn't want to like... Steal the Blade Runner. Yeah. Blade Runner sucks, don't worry about it. It's terrible. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. Yeah. Even, the new, even the new one? Even the new one. 2049 yeah. is not as good as the OG. Oh, yeah. They're all that's, terrible. That's true. I mean, no, no. how we'll, can you we'll not... Stand and we'll watch it, and we'll watch the director's cut, because that was his, 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 his vision. Mm -hmm. Welcome to movie talk. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Sorry. Yes! Host, Laura. We're getting it out of our way now, before <laughs> Tuesday. Okay, so, two small announcements. We're gonna give away one of these mugs. Eee. This is that the hashtag half day. Hashtag half day. Um, half it up. H e f f d a y. Little pre pre announcement just for you guys. The first of the year, January first. <laughs> all day charity straight. Oh. So we're gonna have some. We're gonna so, have some movie by talk. By the way, you guys all have to like movie <laughs> talk. <laughs> movie talk. So we all have to see something Sign together. Me the first fuck off, up. I cannot wait. Wait, so it's it's the day. It's Wednesday, the day. Are you assuming that we're all going to be in great shape today? I'm assuming no. that at <laughs> I'm least a few to stay, people... I'm planning to stay up late playing board games. I don't know what you're planning. <laughs> a few aware. people can be here the night at previous. 10. Others can get here at 2 and 4. That's when the nice thing about an all-day. We're going to start 10 a.m. 10 a.m. And we're going to go to 10 p.m. All right. First. Let's do hours. this. I'm so game, man. It's Wednesday, oh, yeah. so it's our normal pandemic 
board game day. Let's see how I am the night of prior, <laughs> yeah. but I will be there regardless. At, at, at some point, you'll be here. It's movie talks, yes. Right. Mm-hmm. We'll save the yes, movie talk until yeah, we will not schedule here. movie talks for yeah. 10 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> we will, however, have lots of coffee. Throw in hashtag half day. <laughs> come back January 1st. Uh, come back throughout, but mark in your bookmark and in your calendar. Bookmark in your calendar. Ah. We're so, going to yeah. do a 12 so hour charity. 12 trip. hours and the half day. Did just say that's a half day. I'm like, that is okay. in fact technically a it half day. A, yeah. Oh. It's an all day but no night. Ooh. Mm-hmm. Way over. Yeah. But it's winter, so it's actually dark. Yeah, yeah. 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 So that's like, like it's dark at like three. Twelve yeah. hours is like. Oh yeah, no, we'll be playing two from days camp. almost. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll be playing from can to can. <laughs> so like before we took break, we had went to Tanaka's hideout. Tanaka, called Uncle Kaito Tanaka, is oh. an elderly Japanese citizen whose history is shrouded in secrecy. Um, he lives in San Francisco because his country of origin exiled him for unknown crimes, uh, which Hacking. is Tokyo. Probably fiddling around with uh, the maglets. medicine that he shouldn't be <laughs> practicing medicine in ways he probably shouldn't do. Sensor beans, totally. Seen yeah, by the synth see. on the wall, yeah, or the person, the thing on the wall. Um, oh, and I'm the monster. <laughs> he's well, a brilliant you told technician. Him to shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> he dabbles in the physical sciences. He may seem gruff and dismissive, but he has a soft spot for synths and acts as a spy loosely. Uh, of the organization, the Liberation, Synth Liberation Front. Um, he maintains his cover as a dabbler of ancient technology <laughs> and a purveyor of repurposed technology while maintaining his clandestine support for the SLF. So that is Kaito Tanaka, which you would know, probably you would know a little bit, maybe just in folklore, but you probably wouldn't have come across any of his work. Mm-hmm. Um, so as he removes the GPS devices and any sort of basically scratching the serial numbers off of the synth by removing their arms Jeez. up to the shoulder, um, everyone sets out from the lair into the back of Herb's uh, confiscated Frisco's finest truck, which is kind of off the street into the side alley. Um, and we set forward with Herb's driving and everyone in the back of the cab. Um, and I'm towards, probably being the Bart pole again. <laughs> <laughs> towards the uh, Daily City Milbray hangers of SFO. Punch it. I tell <laughs> herbs. <laughs> I'm not slowing down for red lights, nothing. As soon as I get through this thicket, like, it's going to take a mind to stop us. Oh, not God. that I'm looking. And <laughs> avoid mines. Boy, I, I, I heard a plot hook in that one. <laughs> if that, mines did exist in this world, or that was, that was a hard combat hook there. <laughs> All right, so we are setting off. We're we're driving. You feel the rumble. It'll take about twenty minutes to get there because no even, traffic. There's no traffic, <laughs> but there are also no roads. Like the roads are like not really maintained. Oh gods, are we in the Badlands? And yeah. mm-hmm. as you remember, you are in the Badlands, <laughs> but it is at night. Um, unfortunately, though, the headlights stick out like a green hat with an orange bill. You should be driving. Oh gross. In the night. I mean, maybe. With night vision. With night vision. Actually, that's not a bad idea. So as he kind of <laughs> drives out through um, the city, he kind of do do do. Deja! What? I can't see shit. You want to drive? <sighs> Fine. So he pulls over to the side and he mm-hmm. opens it up. Um, I'm gonna. I need to go and access. I need to. Act, uh, while well, you got to switch. I need to access the fuse. The fuse panel. Because? In the car. In the truck. Yeah. Because. What are you why? doing? We gotta dis. You have to disable the the brake lights. Oh yeah. This is true. Okay. Can't we turn them off? No. no. You have to either unscrew the bulbs or you have to pull the fuse. Good really? call. Or break them, but yeah. Mechanics roll. Wait, do I have this? Hold on. I mean, you're the tech person. I should, uh, well. Is it you can be overseeing. Yeah, yeah, I was going to say, can I help or whatever? Do you want to help? Sure. Um, and then while they do that, you make a oh, land vehicle oh. roll. Which I surprisingly garbage. have proficiency in. And you make perception. You get? 13. Cool. I got 10. Cool. 13. Garbage. 17. 17, okay. Wow. In the box, Didn't friend. Didn't even bounce in the box <laughs> once. If you so this it. is this is my thing. Fourteen. My yeah. Uh, 17, Fourteen. Thirteen. Me too. I got ten. This is my thing, but I rolled like a five. Okay. Um, I. 
I mean, it's not hard. You it's know a really it. simple. It's a simple you test. know how to take a fuse out of a fuse box, don't uh, you? Yeah, and they're usually like, like I know how to do that. Yeah. I was just going to try to switch it. It's like you don't know this particular truck or do anyway. Um, yeah, you basically pull all the fuses out. Except for the ignition. Wait! Yeah. <laughs> now we don't have air conditioning. Yeah. God damn it. I'll drive um, the window down. Successfully, <laughs> that's off, but so is also you like your dashboard lighting and stuff like that. With no lights, um, no air. And as you hop in, you're familiar with the mm -hmm. uh, mechanics of the car. Herbs hops into the um, passenger seat. The three of you guys go back into the cab, but before, uh, what'd you roll? 14? 14. Before you go, you see essentially a drone in the distance. Um, basically following the same path that you were just taking. It's maybe a mile behind, um, but you know it's not a carrier drone. You know it's not a delivery drone. Um, no. It is searching. Mm. So, but wait, it's searching. Is it so? It's kind of like on our tail at this point. Yeah. Then. Yeah. 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 All right. Oh, I'm gonna. You, you two what are kind of shifting? drone? Just out of curiosity, what kind of drone is it? Can you identify it? So this, you, this is this? as we're pulled over. Yeah, as you're pulled over. Yeah, you so, so you can tell me. With a 14, can I? What can I tell about the drone? It's an attack drone. Okay. Oh. It's a combat drone. It combat. is not a. But it doesn't yeah. have infrared no. or night scope unless it's been specially outfitted. So let's let's go. Are you sure, drone buddy too? Yeah, I mean, drone buddy two is going to come if <laughs> drone buddy sh shows up, but. You could send your drone out there. No, I'm not going to have fucking air-to-air -air combat right now. <laughs> Let's go. You don't want to have a drone race? Those are amazing. <laughs> <laughs> it's like pod racing. Have you Herb seen slaps on the cell. Let's, Let's go. go. <laughs> okay, Let's go. I, 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 start, start, start the truck up. Everyone brace. Is, and it just like, is, it, is it more obvious to shoot it out of the air? Yes. yes. Okay, fine. All right. Just, just, just like hit the gas and off we go. All right. We go. And, and I'm driving fast but safe. Okay. Yeah, you are able to see miles per hour. Um, the road. <laughs> It's about all the U-Haul can do. <laughs> potholes, um, and you recognize an area. You start to recognize the terrain now, um, because you recognize that this is where the electric electric Diablos had um, s trapped you guys before by setting off a bomb. Mm -hmm. uh, um, oh, so in the in the VR. In the, the, the VR. Yeah. In the VR. No, not in the VR. Um, in the first. In the first. Yeah. In the second. On our episode. way to Mars. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, Fuck. So Fuck them. The bodies are gone, and... It's been a while. The um, Their bikes and their cars have been completely stripped. Uh, as you drive by and you remember that, like, yeah, there's no, there's a Native American reservation not too far from here. Come. Um, and you pull up to an unexpectedly busy um, airport hangar. Mm -hmm. um, lights are going on, commercial traffic's going in and out, so it's not really... Unusual to see a Frisco's finest um, truck. Burrito truck show. Oh, oh my god, yeah. we're gonna get surrounded by people wanting burritos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna turn the lights on as we're approaching the the, the, the civilization. Not the not the brake lights, but like the regular headlights, because I think at this point it'd be standing out way more to not have headlights on. Okay. Um, as you turn that on, there are no gates, there are no guards. Every hangar is its own um, private sort of. Takeoff entity. The hangar we have actually is a smaller one that we rent space from. Oh. Um, but you drive past and you see um, synth droid SFPD um, searching and rifling through hangars. About five hangars down, you're on the tarmac and you're just mm -hmm. zooming towards Herbs is pointing you towards this one. Go this one. Herbs, did you see that? Yeah. Um, we don't have much time. We don't. I think they're they're waiting for us, um, but we're gonna have to load everybody in, and it's gonna be like sardines. Yep. <sighs> Price of freedom. So as um, you go into the hangar, um, herbs kind of pulls down um, the gate. The gate behind us. The, the, the door behind, um, and inside you see a massive cargo ship. Not massive, it's maybe the size of like three school buses or something like that. Um, it's bigger than I thought it was. And so not massive. He opens the top at the same time, you see the roof come up and you know that these things kind of hover and then they breach the atmosphere. Um, and Herbs bangs on the side, hey, out, everybody out. Out and upstairs, all right, we gotta dump you into the crates. And then, Godspeed, you know? Yeah. Um, 
make our spade. <laughs> so everybody gets out. Um, as you I'm actually get, gonna stay in the vehicle. You're gonna stay in the vehicle. Yeah, yeah I'm, if the cops show up, there's no reason for me to be walking around. I'm 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 staying I'm staying behind the wheel and just waiting to like bolt the fuck out of here. You're not getting out. No. Okay. Um, they don't need my help to get them into the crates, as far as I know. If they need my help, they can, they can tell me. Um, so as we get in, you see Herbs up on the Skyjack talking to um, the pilot, who's also being um, lowered into uh, the, cockpit. the cockpit of the ship. And uh, are you with Herbs? Yeah. Uh, is, are there any weapons? Like any, are there any rifles? Anything Stop asking anywhere? for your clout. No. no, there are no weapons here. Is there anywhere vantage point roof thing that I can get to? Yeah, so you can come up to the upper level with us. I mean, and see outside. Um, yeah, yeah, you'd be able to peek over the roof and see outside. Okay, I'm just gonna go do that. You said that we were an attack drone was following us. Yes. How does this thing get off the ground with an attack drone out there? Quickly. Mm. <laughs> That's not. Uh, what this thing is made for? It's gonna. Yeah, that's actually a good question. Oh, how much? How much firepower does an attack drone have? That's true. Not enough to, mm -hmm. to to stop a cargo ship. Um, if it's only got a few shots, like your little buddy. Yeah. Um, the standard ones only have a couple but, shots, and that's it. I mean, who the fuck knows? But uh, Mick here's gonna take care of us and get us out of here, right? He's like, yeah, I got you. Um, so, perception. Uh -huh. Did you roll well? I did. 23. 23. Damn. Damn. So you don't. You look up in the sky and you don't really see an attack drone. Um, you see kind of commercial lights in the air. Um, and you happen to look down as you see a truck skirt right in front of uh, the hangar we're at. And three armed uh, men pull out in front. So I yell down, we got company front door. I'm gonna pop out, pop out of the truck. You're out of the truck. Yeah. Okay. And as soon as I hear that we have company, shotguns ready to go. And you hear banging at the front of the uh, the door. Can he tell us? Can he tell what kind of company is it? SFPD? Is it? Do they have? Um, do they have uniforms or anything that identifies they them? They are heavily armored. You. Shit. Maybe they're friendly. You know that, and <laughs> I'm gonna throw my I'm gonna throw my flashlight down there and go fire in the hole. <laughs> Do you? Yeah. Okay. Oh my oh, god! All right. So Shut as he does that, right um, give me a uh... deception. Yes. This is what oh, it's that's like playing zero. with Thomas. <laughs> I love it. Ten. <laughs> Ten. Oh lord. You yell fire in the hole just as the flashlight comes down and the one mm -hmm. mech. A uh, soldier looks up just in oh, time for the flashlight to hit him <laughs> in the face. I'm gonna fucking kill you! <laughs> <laughs> and he kicks the door open, um, and basically you Kai, see. This will be your department. You see four. Uh, Ping him hard. <laughs> you see four people heavily armed walk through, with three people walk through, and then one SFPD mech behind them, um, and you recognize them immediately as. Um, what kind of basically, mech? yeah, Blade Runners. Uh, basically, um, what kind of mech is robotic? It? Suits. What are they called? Oh, oh they're yes. chappy. Yeah, the no, they're not chappy. <laughs> <laughs> they're not robots. They're is this the uh, thing from reclaimers. Oh, they yeah. the reclamation force. So mm -hmm. um, rogue oh, synths, gotcha. bad oh. synths in the field. Um, okay. Sometimes they need to be taken back by force, and this is the team that does it. Um, How did yeah. they follow us? Very good fucking question. But everyone now is going to roll initiative. Here we go. Oh, shit. Not that nice. D Not that nice. Wow. Ooh, shit. How did well, we roll the same us. number? Really? Yes. Yay. We, we suck. We suck. <laughs> oh. All right. Yikes. Yes. This guy's got, these guys have got great rolls. I don't know what this guy's initiative. Oh do boy. I go, do I go, what is initiative, by the way? It's dex plus proficiency? Yes. Yes, okay. Is it? I don't know. Well, is it just dex? Doesn't it just say initiative at the top of your sheet? 
But yeah, we, we don't have it written in. No, it's oh, not proficiency. Like... It's not proficiency. It's, it's just, just your dex. dex. Yeah. Okay. Dex plus. You, I, 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 have a, I have a three something. to my initiative for some reason. Your sheet over there says yeah, six. Yeah, I do, but my little buddy doesn't. Oh, okay. yeah. Little buddy. All right. That's what I am. So. My little buddy. <laughs> <laughs> What does little buddy do? Sing the rest of the song. I don't know the rest. Okay. My little buddy. This is Ammonium? Yes. <clears throat> and you, this is you? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, you squat. Wait, what? <laughs> where are you Where squat? I'm still in the van. <laughs> I am, the van. I am like yeah. right next to the to the door of the van. I need to let me know, push this up more to Forward. Yeah, down, down. This way, this way. I can Keep see going. It. Keep coming. All right. Much more. You got plenty of room. You have a lot of room. Oh, you have really? more than you think you do. Almost there. And then go that way. That looks good. Bit. Don't listen to me. That way. Almost there. No. Why that? Towards, towards towards me. All Why right. that way? Yeah. Actually, that's good. Yeah. Really? Sure. Yep. Remember, there's like a delay. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Where's so, the van? So you guys are down here. The van is over here. Okay. Um. But you see. An SFPD mech. God. You see two mercs. I can't take zero. I can, I can only take like challenge rating like zero and one. And Not then you see person. a VR Villanueva um, reclamation uh, combat unit. And now we're going to get your ammonia initiative. 11 total. Ooh. Six. Yeah. Fifteen for me. All right. Here you go. So I'm twenty, and then my little buddy's eleven. Uh, Unless you want us to go on the same initiative. <laughs> You're gonna have to because you didn't pull them out before. Okay. All right. That's All fine. Right. Nice. So. Hey, that's good. <laughs> I was just saying that we're both on twenty. He bumps up in the initiative. Since it's the future, is it like a normal drone where you have to like lay out the legs and then you put it in like, well, your phone? No, nah, you just like fling it out, <laughs> out of the backpack and go. <laughs> yeah. He's like, What's the I know. problem? I did everything. <laughs> Reset. Have you tried turning it on and turning it off again? Yes, I have. <laughs> I, I have got to watch that show again. I need to get that out of my storage. Such a good show. Netflix. Is it on Netflix? Yeah. Yes. The A crowd. Or yeah. IT crowd? The IT yeah. crowd. Oh, cool. I haven't seen it. It's still in the queue. It's <laughs> really good. All right. It's a very dry British humor uh, surrounded in an IT department. Yeah. Oh. Morris Moss is amazing. I like to do with so, the that's yeah. where That's why. He's awesome. Yeah. yeah. I've seen him in other stuff. Hi, long have you? Hi. He's got weirdness. Great sense of sound. You're yep. up first. <laughs> in um, order to get to the level <laughs> that. Um, <laughs> we're at, you're gonna have to hit the ladder. What do you mean? So, you're a level down from us. Oh, These got guys it. are a level up. Okay. And then the cargo ship up above got it. is And one where more are level these higher. guys? Those are guys are down by me. They're on the floor they're, with us. They're, right? they're on the floor okay. with you guys. So, um, I'm still hiding in the truck, so I'm gonna like open my door and, and launch my drone and r launch Little Buddy. Okay, so. Little Buddy, go. Second. Little buddy, Get away! Little buddy. If it's not Gordon Beers, we pretend to pee it into the mud. <laughs> <laughs> thinking about that. <laughs> so oh, you're Lord. you're spotted, but she is on the other side of the drone, That's on the fine. other side of the yeah. thing. No, no. Yeah. So I basically just like open <laughs> I'm, the window. I'm, I'm a tank. I'm meant to be spotted. I will... Open the window. Let the little buddy out. All right, and little buddy is up. Into the air. Mm -hmm. um, or at least what just I will say is ready to go. The shots <laughs> made from high down below will be given advantage. Ooh, good to know. Um, so, Kai, you're up. Your bonus action was to release the drone in the air. Mm -hmm. What's the action? Mm, oh, so ping I can em. actually ping do em. a thing. Yeah, so I'm gonna hit a ping ID on. Ma it was it was Mac and. Mech and something. And two, what are the two in the middle? Um, those are mercenaries. 
Um, so SFPD and then the reclamation team, but officially. Mechs and Mercs. Yep. Damn it, give me my Yeah, so I, 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 I sure want to hit like, the two mechs and one of, one of those guys. Doesn't matter which one. With a ping? Get out yeah, of my head. head. <laughs> is it a reclamation a mech? Or is that just a regular? It's a regular. Okay. Yeah, so. Um, two, where's my pen? Where'd my pen go? Uh, in front of the uh, yeah. DM screen. So two mechs and a merc, and they've got to hit a DC saving throw, wisdom saving throw of 13. And they walk into a bar. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I short circuited which, which, one, which one has a sausage under its arm? <laughs> <laughs> That's the fun. And the halfling says, Boy, I'm glad I'm short. I, 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 I look like it really hurt. <laughs> Walk the into a bar. walks into a bar. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody runs away. <laughs> oh, you're never mind. I'll talk to you later about the. I want you to run a mitten with Lacrity. All right. I so I'm going to. Uh, DC, I want to hate it. <laughs> 13. 13. Have, 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 for the Mercs. 12 does not pass for the mercs. Me, what, me, which, me, me, wait, me, wait, who did you hit? So you hit one so, merc and the SFPD? Yep, yeah, SFPD and then one. No, one merc, SFPD, and one mech. Have, 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 have me DM it, you can play alacrity. <laughs> so merc did not make it. SFPD now with a four does not make it. And then the rec. Uh, why can't I say it? The reclamation yep. uh, person. With 17 makes it. So okay, what's the so damage? Okay, so two out of the three. Um, so it's three points of damage for each. Oh, and there's no DR with that. Nope. All right. So um, with that, a drone flies in from over the top. There it is. And flies down. And it's going to fire a shot off. At you with no cover for 19. 19. Mm. Mm. Damn it. Hit. Such a good number. All right. <laughs> so, yeah. And it's going to get you four, three. Should I take two of that? Boom. I take one of that. Sorry. You take one of that. Um, and that's its turn. And now the villain Nueva drone. Uh, not the drone. So uh, the villain Nueva reclaimer on page 247 <laughs> is going to be an augmented veteran. Don't look. Yes, right Fuck. there. <laughs> we had it open. It was already open. I was like, For you following at home in your PDF, you <coughs> that's who we have. Ow. Um, so he is going to walk up to Deja um, and is going to throw two punches left and a right. You see he's got a massive combat shotgun on his back. Okay. Um, he's just about your size. Wow. Um, but he's also heavily geared up. Mm -hmm. um, so with 19 hits. 19 hits. So that's going to be six for the first punch. All right. And a six Wait, for the second punch. Where is he? He made it all the way over right there. Right here. Yep. Did Five, he seven, make it? 15, 20, 25, 30. Okay. There's, yeah. Yep. Gotcha. So you guys are toe to toe. Okay. So I took how much damage? 12. He beat, boom, he beat the boom. crap out of her. <laughs> yeah. This time. He's reinforced. <laughs> he's definitely strong. And now it's Ryoga's go. Uh, ah, so I'm gonna shoot the drone. All right. <laughs> All reluctant because it's not a human. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That's the joke. What? I love you it. said heal. <laughs> uh, that's not gonna hit. No. Well, I uh, actually. It does because no, nine, it's not. It's nine, an eight. It's nine an eight. Hits. Okay. It's an eight. Is it? Oh worth? my God! You're right. I spend luck. Is it worth an insp? Yeah. No, twelve hits. Oh, sorry, twelve. <sighs> I mean, we have it, but it's a reroll. It yeah, let's, a re -roll. let's let's do it. Use a good dice. If, if, if you guys are okay, okay. yeah, I'll switch dice. So you can use. Does that does that count as a shot, or I still only have the one shot? Still only the one shot. Okay. Eighteen plus three, yeah. twenty-one. Twenty-one. Twenty-one hits. What? How much damage did you do to it? This is two d four piercing because I haven't uh, changed mags. So this <laughs> is am armor piercing. For five points of damage. Damn. That does a lot. You knock it off its axis. Um, the mercs go next. And <laughs> the first merc is going to come up and try to um, swing at you. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. So you're surrounded by two. Mm -hmm. um, and he's going to take a swing at you while you're locked up for 17. 17 hits. All right. Does one damage. The second merc is going to start making its way up. Uh, so this is just this entire ladder. You just make it. It's one step. Okay. 20, 25, 30, 
Um, and he's going to fire at you. 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, at disadvantage with his 21st century pistol. Um, that weak little thing. 40 is the range. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 40, 50. Yeah, so disadvantage. That was a three. So he shoots at you, and one pelts off the background. Ping! So now you know you're being targeted twice. That's his turn. Monium, you are up. Let's do this. Um... That person right in front of me? When are they? When? Um, that's, that is herbs. I'm an idiot. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> uh, I, actually, no, I'm in this. I, I didn't even roll initiative for myself. I was supposed to say, I shoot herbs. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay. I will go last. Sorry. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> a malfunction in my joke protocol. <laughs> but you really shot me. I am going to... Tr- Try and get as close as I can within range so it's not a disadvantage. So that tube that you see right there, that's the ship. That's the cargo ship. Hmm. Um, And every turn, it's slowly inching its way out. So we're buying it time to get out. Oh, wait. All the synths are on it. All All the synths Mm -hmm. are on board. Okay, good. Um, (sighs) There's a drone over here that needs to be shot. Yes, I'm running. I mean, okay. there's also two people engaged with me that I would really yeah. like to have shot off of me. That's what I was thinking of. The territory, the brown ground, can I actually cross no, that? No, so that is... A level down. Fall. That is a fall. That is a heavy fall. Um, can I hit them if I go to the edge of that? Yeah. I will do that. I'm going right. to go to the edge of that for some of the movement. Mm. Five, ten. One. And aim to shoot at least one of them. Which one? Uh, the one you have to probably shoot at the restrictor because you run the risk of hitting Deja if you shoot at yeah. the mercenary. But if you roll a one, bad things happen. I'm willing to take the risk if <laughs> she is. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh god. Um, it's also 11. heavily armored. Eleven total. Eleven does not hit the. Yeah, uh, I'm in favor of sure. using inspiration. Let's yeah, inspire that. Do it. Augmented event. That was the first one I didn't catch in like three months. Here we go. Nice. 19. 19. 19. Plus 24. 26. 24. 24. No, no, no. With you do the math. Your first shot, bang, uh, to do damage. How much is it? Uh, 2d8 for the first fire? Yeah. <coughs> and keep me track of the shots now. Uh, so am I. Uh, 14 damage. 14? Really? On the first hit. Yeah. 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 Six, six and an eight, man. All right, so see, doesn't take all of that, but he takes a decent amount of it. <coughs> hmm. So uh, he has a second. He has another shot. Yeah. I am ambidextrous. <laughs> <laughs> Nineteen. 19. Yes, yeah. you are. <laughs> Different two d eight. That's the fun of this. You shouldn't uh, have done that. Oh, I really shouldn't this. have. Um, yeah, three um, damage. Three? Yeah, on this one. You hit his armor and you watch it pelt off. Mm-hmm. Bing! Don't forget Bing. to mark that. Yeah. <laughs> um, so he takes we'll 11. That. Disengage that. Oh. Cool. So if I... And now, Deja, you're up. I, I know, I'm going to move closer around. to the drone. Yeah. Please. To the drone. Radius. Yeah. Yeah. From, uh, with the rest <laughs> of my movement, then I'm done. 15, so 20, 25, 30. So, so you're up a, but near then me. does that negate? All right. Um, as a bonus action, I'm going to go into a fury. Yeah. Because I'm getting real pissed at these people right in my face. Just as a I don't know. You can try it. Okay. <coughs> Everything good, guys? Yeah. Uh, we um, did get uh, we did get 500 bits from who? Lucifer Vilcheck. Wow, thank did you. I call that? I called that. Did you? Yeah. When? Okay. I'm pretty sure. Just, I, uh, oh, I mean, just right now. It, he just said, now. For Ryoga to handle the situation. All right. Vilcheck. <laughs> <laughs> I will be done. Everybody look out. <laughs> yeah, basically. Who needs handling? Who? <laughs> Any of those gentlemen there, sir. Right. Thank you, sir. Asia. Just is it better to rain. stay here and take the, the beating and keep attention on me, or is it better to disengage and run? That is my question. Hmm. Wait, you went already? No, I haven't. Oh, yeah, you pinged him. Yeah, you did. Yeah. At the very top of the round. Yeah. Um, I'm going to draw my, my face shift knife and... What? No. 
Okay. <laughs> uh, and go after the, the, the merc. All right. You're in the face shift knife. Mm. Okay. I, I'm not going to shoot with a shotgun directly into someone's face. Why? Why not? Disadvantage. <laughs> Disadvantage, but also... Hell, why not? It should be advantage, realistically, because... <laughs> Honestly, in real life! Uh, it's a 10 out of 10 shot. How are you missing? So, <laughs> in real life, yeah, no, that is how it should really, be. Shotguns are meant for up-close things. You well, should um, be able to just, like, bang, hole through someone. Yeah. What does that, it That mechanic here? drives me nuts. Tillamook. Is that in here? Or Swiss cheese? <laughs> what? Swiss cheese. <laughs> It's a brand cheese. I like no, it. I like, I know, I like I, that I brand I like of cheese. I've, what been, is, I've been to the factory. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. That's it's so awesome. I would say that a knife makes sense. Um, you used your bonus action already. Yes, to fury. Okay. And what, what will that add to your attack? Uh, it adds nothing to my attack, but it helps my damage resistance. OK. So I have advantage on strength, sa- uh, strength checks and fortitude saving throws. I get a plus two bonus to a damage roll when I make an attack. And I have resistance to bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing. Ah, okay. You didn't have that bludgeoning mm. before, right? Okay. Or yeah. pier- or or uh, or piercing, because I I always I always have resistance to ballistic, but there's bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing, and then there's ballistic. All right. So Do going it. into a fury is the best thing for I me to talk say about that. You could use your bonus action to like free yourself from because like it's it's you're close it's close combat, and so well, pulling out your knife makes yeah. sense, but reaching around for your shotgun yeah, would be like super deliberate. Points. Right, but I already had it out. You had your shotgun out? I have to. I never put it away. I just like leaned it up against my leg while I was driving. Um, Take a shot. I never put my shotgun away when when I'm in the middle of what I think will be dangerous. I'll give you a straight shot on the shotgun on one person. Okay, I'll take a straight shot on the mech person in front of me. On the mech guy. Okay. Well, that did nothing. Uh, 19. It was, it was <laughs> total. That I want 19. a 19 out of this. Uh, fine. <laughs> Give me a 19. Energy. You know what? That's better. That's a 17. 17 Close to hit. Enough. Damn you, fate. Uh, it should hit, according to what I saw <laughs> on page 247. <laughs> yes, it does. It's same these are better. Does. All right, let's see some damage. All right, so because I'm Fury and I have an extra D6 to add to my 3D8. <laughs> uh, wow. Confirm that there's a lot of sevens. <laughs> Uh, that would be 14 plus 5 is 19 plus another 7 is... 26, 26. plus 2 damage because, because I'm under Fury is 28 points of damage directly to this guy's face. Right, it takes a massive chunk out of the armor. He's like... <laughs> His facial armor. He's looking half as good as he was looking before. Fantastic. Um, but he is reinforced. These... these uh, Robotic synth reclaimers, <laughs> they're known for being pretty fucking rough. Um, and... With that, the SFPD is now up. <laughs> uh, That's the little dude with the hat, right? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> did, 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 you, did, you, did you model that? Yeah. No, no. So that is from Dragonforge, but we did paint it. I love it. Um, yeah, right. I wish I could model something like that. Um, but you could. Tiana being nice, everybody. <laughs> um, so he's going to walk Put up. Put it in the calendar. doesn't happen often. <laughs> yeah. Bookmark this day. Um, freeze, citizen. Do not resist. And he takes a shot at Deja. Do I have like half cover because I'm behind yep. that yeah. person? Yep. <laughs> I'm on one. Come on Ooh, one. okay. That's going to be a 16. Uh, if it's half cover, then that doesn't hit because because half cover gives me a plus two and that makes it a 17. Ah, uh, pink. Um, and now <laughs> he walks up and he's on the second flight. Um, and it is Herb's go. Herb, seeing the trouble that Deja's in, um, down below, he runs over to the edge where Monium just was, and he fires off a ping echo to the SF mech, the Reclaimer, and the Mercenary, and they need to make a save, a DC save of... It's like your proficiency no. plus. No, um, no. There's on the ping echo. There is no save. They just take the damage. I thought it was Mm-mm. using an action. You create three pings that you can broadcast into a creature's neural network. You can send all three to one creature or target up to three different creatures within range. Then, then, the, then the third yeah. one should have, should have taken that damage as yeah. well because she's oh. all three. Yeah, you are right. It's basically a magic missile. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, she, I mean, she is Stop basically it. our wizard. <laughs> 
fucking stop it. So who didn't take it before? Oh, the VR guy didn't take it before. So he take he took what? Oh God, I can't remember. Three. It's like three. three. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's not in great shape. Good. Um, Get him. He's down to that. So with a one d four, herbs basically overloads their comms. Damn it! In the box, friend. For two points of damage to each three, it's really an annoyance um, to them. The SFPD is kind of looking rickety, and the Merc is getting pissed off. Okay. Kai. I have one quick question before I do all my things. How do I communicate with my drone? With your little buddy? Yeah. Um, you use your action to basically... No, I mean, like, is it comms? Is it... Like, how do I tell it what to do? Yeah, um, so I think like a remote control interface is pretty. Is it part of the neural link? Yeah, it's part of the neural. But you, it's not like you're like controlling it in like dual pistol. Okay. Or anything. Like you're controlling it pretty. Okay, because my question would be if I hit blackout, which is comms. Is it a bonus? Well, no, it would be my action. So the drone would do its thing, and then I would hit blackout on in a 20 foot radius here. And would that black out their ability to give communications to their drone? Um, so I'm asking side of the technical, like, how do I communicate with my drone and how does that translate into what I know about how they communicate with their drones? And mm. would blackout, would comms blackout? So comms that? blackout, w there's nobody here controlling the drone. This drone is pre-programmed. Got it. Okay. For a specific okay, so mission. it's kind of AI. It's yeah. going to do what it's going to do regardless of what we do to it. Yeah. Okay. All right, so then I'm going to fly my drone probably five feet above me so that it gets back to X. <laughs> and it is going to shoot at Mr. Mac. Mr. Mac. So it's going to go Mac. above you. Yep. Okay. Actually, it gets back. Tactics. It doesn't matter. Because, because I'm be, five feet away. Yeah, it could be that. Yeah, so it could be above Deja, too. It doesn't. Okay. I just want to make sure that You're I have it. You're going to fire at Mercenary or, or uh, Mac. Reclaimer? Mac. Mac Man. All right. Oh, give me a card. You got a 20? <gasps> yep. Yes. I got, I got a 20 and an 18. So. You fire yeah. one. Yep, I do, but advantage gives me. Oh, pack, so pack, pack, I definitely mm -hmm. shoot something because that's 20. I mean, you plus. have advantage. That's 20. Yeah. Plus whatever it is. Plus hey, four. blanket term. Thanks for rating hey. us so much. Hi guys. Hey. Appreciate the support. Oh. Hi Don. Kiss for kiss. Amy to crit with her drone. <laughs> right. Can oh. I? Is that max damage? Um. Yep. So it would be. Is it? Yeah, it would be. Oh, the, so the card. Oh. No, no, it's not. It's choose your initiative score. But oh. a twenty is max damage, so it's two d four. Just in time. I mean, it's just too late for it now. <laughs> Come on, can somebody move? Well, your could you up? change it? I don't know. Could no, I change your initiative? We, oh. That should be the Come on. Card hard to make it the useful. Card we use fortuitous circumstance. That's where you draw the line. Hey, no. <laughs> oh man, can we trade it in for a better card? Okay, so it's three, four, what? five, six, seven, eight. So, so are you doing four d four? Yes. Or, okay. So it's 44 plus 4. Yep. So it is 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, plus 4 is 12. 12. Yes. Yep. Damn. Okay. Uh, so this guy, it's the you notice the bullet going through and it punctured the armor. Um, and he is leaking out mm -hmm. of the, you. You see blood coming through. Oh, the but armor wait, there's plating. more. <laughs> um, so my drone comes back to me because he can fly 60, and that's my drone's turn. But I will do the thing. What shall I do? Because hmm. it has its own separate. Well, you think action. about what to do. No. Okay. okay. Never mind. Go, go, ahead. go for it. I'll go for it. M Monk Tats has gifted five subs to people. Who so Monk Tats, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, wow. thank you. That's 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 my friend Nick in in Fairbanks. Hey, oh, no, no, no. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for being so generous. We really appreciate it. Thank you. And then I will. You're amazing, my so friend. So if you're wondering why Amy gets two turns, it's because at third level she picked up a skill called uh, Hacker Companion. Yeah, it's Robo um, Technics or something like which that. Which allows Sounds her. familiar. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop it. It's Technomancy, basically. So Every story her has Robotic <laughs> Familiar also gets an initiative and also gets uh, an attack action. She didn't roll for initiative for it because she pulled it out during the fight, which means it stays with her. Yeah, her my initiative. initiative is like top of the lineup. Yep. <laughs> so my drone has come back to me because it has a fly speed of 60. 60. Yep, so it obviously went up and came back um, to hide like we do. And then I'm going to ping Echo the mech again. Wait. All three to the mech. 
Ooh, so what? your action yes, was as a human. to, as a human, your action was to ping them. Yes. No. No, your action was to control the drone no. to shoot them. It has its own initiative yeah. score, so it has its own action. Yeah. It actually so says not, it, so it's, it's not it's, her. Wait, 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 wait. So, so, so it's not her action it's, then to control it. It has its own thing and it does its own thing and and, and it does it does what she asks it to. Yeah, the drone does not have ping echo. No, I do. So yes. the drone so went, and it, shot. It went up and shot. The drone was the crit. Yep. Yes. The drone was okay. a crit because it has pack tactics, yep. so it rolled advantage on the mech and it rolled and a 20, and now I have go. a card, and yes. now I get to go. Yes. So I'm going to ping echo all three of them on that dude. You. On that one guy. Yeah, why not? Okay. Is appreciated. So it is, he takes two plus what? Two plus one. Two plus one plus one. So one d four plus one. So that's three points of damage. Ooh. But three, well, six, but it's, nine. It's, 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 yeah, three. three times. Yeah. So you hit him three times. Yeah, so yeah. it's three, six, pew, pew, nine. Pew. Nine okay. points of damage. So as that ping echo goes off in his ear, you it's loud enough that it pops um, the comms out of his ear. And he slowly starts to, he falls down to a knee and he leans heavily on Deja as he falls to his back. It's like, mm. And you see his, all the orifices in his face and his nose and his ears are just gushing blood. He is down. Cool. And I, and, 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 and I, like, I like turn the shotgun and shove him off of me yeah. and then turn on the other person when it's my turn. Sweet. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. So now this drone um, moves over into, uh, actually, no, he doesn't. This drone inches. Hey, no, the drone didn't do anything. He just stands there and he fires a shot at you. He misses. <laughs> um, and that's the drone's turn. That would have been the reclaimer's go, but he is gone. Now it's Ryoga's Bang. turn. I will Bang. shoot a drone. La -la -la -la. You're just having. One up fight with the drone! Natural yes. one! Oh my god! Don't mess it up so bad that like I can't use it. Miss on an attack roll. Ah, uh, that is. These are good ones! I need to fight with I am down to. <laughs> I need those cards. I'm down to 13 on the old uh, armor piercing. Pew, pew, pew. Oh. Mm -hmm. I have like 200 in regular rounds. 17. <laughs> yeah, but you have to take a bonus action to trade out mags. Yep. The mercenary is going to go. He's gonna 5, 10, 15, 20. He's gonna look at herbs, um, but out the side of his face, seeing uh, the reclaimer go down, he spots you and your drone. Uh oh. Um, and he's gonna take his cop pistol and fire down Did you at say cop you. Pistol? Um, we, are it's taking, we are taking that after we kill him. It's them. the 21st century pistol, it's not the cop pistol. Uh, <laughs> no, you we, said cop pistol. So well. I, but the first time I said 21st, yeah, I was you, reading you did, it from yeah. the book. Fair. And that's going to be a 16. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Boom! So the cop pistol... Uh, 2d4. Sorry. Oh, uh, the 21st pistol. century pistol is 2d4. And that's going to be for five points of damage. Okay. Did you do the uh, damage reduction? Oh, no, you're sorry. Thank you. Good call. Um, and that's his turn, but the second... Uh, guard, watching his friend go down, is gonna swipe at you with a phase knife. Aww. That didn't land in there, clearly. Was it good? No. Oh. That's not much better. 13. Nope. Sw swings and misses Just like duck a as shoulder he back. stares <laughs> at you uh, with, the, with the phase shift knife mm -hmm. just emanating. Uh, light saber-ish noise. <laughs> um, <laughs> Monium, you're up. Uh, I'm gonna make a charge. Wait, how close do I have to be so it's... I'm going to get the bare minimum distance away I can so it's not like at disadvantage, but within range. Of within who? range Of the drone attacking Thomas. All right. Uh, Ryoga. So <laughs> I've never that he's the R1. If I you just stop in R1. here, you don't have any cover. If you stop on the bridge, you have half, uh, half cover from those guys. Is it disadvantage from where I'm shooting, though? If I want to aim for the drone? No, I shouldn't be. No, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, no. Oh, cool. For your revolver? Yes. Yep. Um, so if you want to, like, pop out, come forward five feet, and then and then pop back into cover. He doesn't even have to move. Yeah. Yeah, he could, though. Gun time. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. Um, <laughs> no, it's good. Dirty 20. Dirty 20. Dirty 20 hits. It's Monium's catchphrase. <laughs> <laughs> it's gun time, everybody. It's gun time. <laughs> Wait, do we have the Dirty 20 emote? Oh my god, we do. Do we? Yeah, Tom's made a Dirty 20, yeah, <laughs> dirty 20 emote. That's, yes. cool. That's awesome. <laughs> ah, how do you do it? I don't know. Plus yeah. 20. No. No, it's dirty. It's Quest Dirty. 
What'd you get? Six on the first is hit. It I think so. Six on the first hit is it. enough to shatter the rotor of this drone and send it. Uh, I don't think it was approved. Sorry. Aww. Oh. Yet? Yes. <laughs> There's so, hope. Ammonium fires at the drone, hits one of the rotors, it goes wild and slams into the wall and explodes. No! This drone is drunk. <laughs> that could have been a friend! <laughs> in the distance, it can be repaired. Come on! <laughs> and I shoot at, uh, if I can make it, this dude. At Which the... one, the PD or the cover? Because uh, he's got three quarter cover. Mm, the which PD has a plus five to his armor. Half, um, and if you take a shot at the Merc down there, it's disadvantage and. The PD. Dangerous in a way. Let's go to the PD. All right, so you aim at the second one, the SFPD. I'm sorry, brethren. Yes! Um, 18, 5, 23. Ah, that hits. Yes! Mock it. Oh, yeah. Once I land it, yeah. 10 total damage on this one. Okay. Um, hitting it. Uh, seeing it over after you shoot the first one, shoot the second one, you nail it right into the side as it falls over dead. But fortuitous circumstance, as it falls off the cliff, uh oh, it lands on Deja. Describe it. <laughs> yeah. Tell, tell, yeah. tell, tell, tell yeah. us, tell us the story. I yep. must be entertained. Okay. Yes, we have to be entertained <laughs> because right. we are your audience. Let me get my caveat. <laughs> Remember that. So, the, so, so, the, so the chat has to yes. approve or dis- yes. No, no, that's what yes. we're gonna work up to. We're not gonna get there yet. <laughs> All right. I'm just getting you guys used to the idea. Let's hear it. <laughs> so, Monium looks at the drone and he fires at it with one shot, hitting it in the rotor, sending it flying, just careening off to the distance. <laughs> Brilliant, dazzling light show from below, and everyone kind of looks up um, as Monium <laughs> looks to the left and single shots the drone, uh, the SFPD mech, to the head, shattering it just as it clefts up over uh, the climbing wall and falls slowly back down. Deja looking up just in time after the explosion to see it. Uh, falling down towards her has to make a dexterity saving throw. See, I'm inclined to give it a thumbs down. It's because I have to make the throw. But like, I think that was that was well told. Well that that, yeah, was, that well was well told. told. Fourteen. Fourteen. <sighs> you move out of the way. Cool. <laughs> Just in time to see it come down. It crashes right next to you and shatters and splits. Just like duck yeah. ag- again against the truck. Um, and Monium, Deja, you're up. All right, do I still get a straight shot at the person who's directly in front of me, or is that a disadvantage? Uh, that's a disadvantage. Why did I get a straight shot on the first person? Because we were just kind of debating yeah. that. Should've Plus, been it, it should have yeah. been disadvantage, but it, I mean, it makes sense since you already had it out. Now you're dodging a falling mech, you're pushing a corpse off of you, and the Hefner has given a thousand what? bits. What? Two. Two. To the players. Yay! Thank you so much, yes. Thank you so much. Yay. Thank you, Hef. We appreciate it. We need it. I have way too much over here. We'll send, we have some, three. send some that way. Nice. Thank you guys thank need you, one more. We have two. Okay. okay. So we're almost even. Give us one more and we'll be completely even. <laughs> I don't think we ever drew the, uh, I don't think we did the drawing. No, oh, that's what I thought you were announcing before. Let's do, yeah. let's do, let's do the drawing let's do now. Let's do the drawing. Hashtag Hef What is it? Hashtag Hef Hashtag Hef Day. Did it crash? No, it's okay. Have to be here to win. Hashtag Hef Day. Throw it in. So, Deja's rearing her shotgun around to try to clip the second Merc. Um, at disadvantage, she's gonna try to fire off a shot with her shotgun. This person's less armored than the other one, so yes. disadvantage isn't the worst. It's not great, but it's not the worst. Uh, so that would be a 19 to hit. 19? Uh, 17 to hit. Oh, wait, it's gonna be close. Wait. Page. What page? <laughs> yeah, I'm not telling you. Calculate. 229. Uh, what'd you say it was? 17. 17 hits. Excellent. <laughs> All those dice, I feel like this is over. It's wonderful. Uh, 11, <laughs> uh, 13, 15, 15 points of damage. Ooh, 15 points of damage, Let me, what, what happens? All right, so as I'm, as I'm like dodging away from this falling mech and looking up and going, Really? Okay, <laughs> fine. Swing around, point the shotgun at, at this guy, rack, rack the shot in, and just like, I'm, I'm, I'm used to close quarter combat, so yeah. I'm, I'm, I get a pretty good beat on this guy, shoot him, his brains explode all over the truck, out, out from behind. Um, he tries to fall onto me and I just shove him off, I'm like, hmm, stupid human men. 
Um, the Merc, the secondary Merc, sees this and realizes that he's fast. Very alone. alone. <laughs> um, it's Herbs' go, and Herbs is going to trade a shot with the, the Merc that's left with his cop pistol, and it's not going to hit. That's going to be a 13. Uh, this guy has three quarter cover. He um, won't for much longer. Because I'm coming true. back. Actually, uh, after, sorry. Uh, after after I make my my turn, I'm, I'm gonna I, I, I want to come up behind him. Okay. Just to scare the shit out of him. I already went. Give it. I'm, I'm just moving. I'm not uh, doing anything. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, or do you want to be like here? Yeah, I'll be. I'll, I'll I'll actually be like right by the stairs, so not completely, right. not using all of my forty movement as a wormer with long legs. Nice. What? And we did the giveaway, and Johnny Nomad. Johnny Nomad. That's not a name I've heard before. Yeah, congratulations. congratulations. Were they actually here to win? Yes, they were. All right, Johnny yes. Nomad, congrats. congrats. Haven't heard that name before. Nice Welcome. These are great mugs. I love them. I have a couple of them. Welcome to the community. Thanks for joining us. We're glad to have you. Um, make sure you go to the Discord, too, for everybody watching. Have help us out. Exclamation, Exclamation point, point Discord. Discord in the yep. chat. 30% off all. If you want your own mug, you can get one on the store. Exclamation point merch. 30% off with code FOXY at checkout. F-O-X-Y. Cyber Monday, y'all. <laughs> Cyberpunk Monday. <laughs> All right. Um, it should have been carbon then if it was Cyberpunk Monday. Kai, you are up. Okay. And then your drone. Who's going first? So my drone's going to go first, okay. and I'm not going to use pack tactics, but I am going to raise up so that I have, well, can I, how many feet? 60 feet. I could probably, mm -hmm. how how high is 30 feet compared to where that guy is to get him under half, like, full cup? For you, I it's, it's okay. one stack so, block, like one block. Yeah. So the drone, do I have yeah. advantage or do I have disadvantage? Or do I have, you have at, Right there you have disadvantage, but if you wanted to move the drone. I want to go up. So right where you're at, yeah. just there. moving the drone up, he's got three-quarter cover. Um, Even if sh it's shooting from above yeah. over, over him? You want to go high Yes. High. Yeah, I want to get up him. Up above him. Freezing. We've <laughs> uh, been doing a lot of that this that's show. That's weird today. <laughs> um, so I give him half cover. Yeah. Do, okay. Do you want to swing around behind? Because you can't get that. Like, Got they're it. The, like, so actually, so hey, actually, actually no. Five, you can. ten, you totally fifteen. Can. So if I go fifteen this way and then fifteen feet up, I would be on his level. Yeah. With no cover. With no me. cover. Okay. But I just get a regular roll then, <laughs> right? Yeah. <clears throat> Oh, poo. Got enough. Welcome. Yeah, yeah. Let's, yeah, let's, let's do it again. Throw a thing. So different dice. And Same number. Equally as shitty. Um, At so least it wasn't naming. Nine. 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 Um, this is our third time around, but you didn't attack with the first one. Click. No, so the drone is going to need to be reloaded. Yeah, I don't so, know why I told you that. No, so this is my second, <laughs> attack. So this is my second attack, so yeah. he would obviously fire, miss, and then I've got to bring him back 30. Um, so that's the, Here, end of my birdie. Yeah, that's the end of my drone's move. Um, I don't a know. bonus action to reload it. <sighs> but it's your turn, right? Yeah, yeah now it's her turn. But so it's you... my turn. I'm just wondering, what else are we doing today? Because I don't know if I want to use any more botnets. I mean, I feel like I feel like we need to go to bed pretty soon because it's it's the middle of the night. It's basically midnight. Okay. Yeah. So I feel like we're gonna take a long rest okay. pretty soon. This all ship right, is so almost then gone. I'm gonna do all three pings <laughs> on our That's remaining guy. And all. <laughs> it's like inches away. <laughs> so I'm gonna hit my ping up echo times three, so that cool. four plus one is five times three is fifteen points of damage. Fifteen. Yep. Let me roll and eat. This guy, three D four, is hurting and he rips out like. He's ripping out circuitry. It's like so annoying to him, and he is starting to bleed from facial orifices as a result of this staticky ping echo. Um, it it hurt him a lot. Okay, and then if I get a bonus action, I'm gonna reload my little baby drone. My little baby okay. drone. <laughs> um, you should call it Tweety. Ryoga, you're up. Um, I'll just from here. I guess I'll just shoot at disadvantage. All right. Um, this, uh, wait, wait, what's your pistol? Yeah, well, it's 21st century pistol. 21st, 40 feet. Mm -hmm. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. Um, half cover, no disadvantage. Oh, okay. Right at pistol range. Nice. 14. 14. Yeah. 
14 not hits. Gonna, what? Even, even with the cover? No, it doesn't. Sorry. Yep. I just overplayed my hand. <laughs> uh, and then I'm going to move 30 to get back around. 5, 10, 15, 20, oh, 25, 30. I'll just stand, I'll just go right behind that thing. Just, just like hang out there? Yeah, I'll just hang out right now. There's <laughs> nobody left. <laughs> Except this guy who's yeah. going to be dead here pretty soon. Yeah, you know what? He's not going to shoot me. <laughs> but just in case. You know, <laughs> cowering behind a pillar. He might not shoot you, but I'll tell you what he will do. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Na 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 na. Yeah. All right, keep keep it up. Na 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 na. Three targets that you can see. <laughs> yeah, and I want him shooting at me. He knows why he's here, and he doesn't want to go back home empty-handed. He's not going back home. He wants that Commodore 64 I stole from. <laughs> you took the Commodore 64. <laughs> no, just don't worry. Yeah, he just got out with it. So, what you see him do in slow motion. Is pull out a grenade. Oh, I want that. <laughs> and he looks at the cargo ship slowly hovering off into the distance. As he pulls the pin, where the fuck? Someone rolled. Let me one. check. Not the index. Thomas knows the stats on content. grenade. Table of contents is really good in this. Is it? Yeah. How? <laughs> oh. It's basically an index. <laughs> <laughs> Just on the wrong side of the book. Yeah. Minus a couple pages. <laughs> Minus specific words was, and things. Yeah. It's okay, well, okay but it is significantly Tools better than the player's card. handbook, yeah. where it's where, where you look up something that says, see other thing. Yeah. Five Grenade, times. Mark one is 2d8 piercing. 60 feet? 60 feet. Piercing, you say? Okay. Frag mark two is 3d8 piercing. 60. 3d8, so he's got a frag mark two. Oh my god. Thanks! Yeah, thanks, Thomas. It's 150,000 wow. long longs for that one grenade. Yeah, that's a lot of cargo on that ship. Um, but the ship itself also has. I mean, it has an armor, so class. armor class. He's 25 away plus how many up? Right, because it's floating away. It's, it's floating, been away. floating yeah. away in the it's last like, four moved, turns. It's only been three turns. Mm -hmm. um, so three. 12 seconds. Yeah. Uh, eight, 18, 18, 18 seconds. seconds. It's it's not that far away. Okay. It's still in the hangar bay, but it's almost out. Okay, and but I'm it just, should be a fair way. Uh, it should be far enough away that he gets like disadvantage or something. The range like is up. sixty. Do you, does but he's having to chuck does up. Anyone have a reaction? Five, 10, 15, 20, 25. But he's going up. Beyond, it's on a different <laughs> level. So because, twenty-five because, there. Because he said it's going how up. How high up do you think? Uh, if, if if it was floating up and it was already floating up before they got in, I'd say at least thirty feet. Oh, so, so okay, so 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 what's the speed on 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 the cargo ship? Because it's been three rounds. Um, so essentially, once it hits lower orbit, it takes off, but it has to get to okay. that staging but, area. So but how but, fast, but how fast does it do that? Um, because I mean, if we have thirty to forty feet per per six seconds, if that were me, that'd mm -hmm. be you know one hundred and twenty feet, and it'd be well out of range by now. I see what you're saying. I'm gonna say that this is Dame Lindelof tragically slow moving. <laughs> <laughs> Enough. Well, it takes off. So I, I what? What? What, what, about, what about? What about twenty <laughs> feet? What about about twenty feet That's per round? I'd say can. it's on the <laughs> end of the range of uh, the grenade throw. So okay. So does, does it doesn't okay. get disadvantage? No, uh, it's a straight roll because okay. the grenade throw is sixty feet. Also, tell me where it like where you got to be specific where it lands because look where I am. Oh yeah. Well, it'll explode way above you if it's if it's going for you the cargo hope. ship. You hope. Um, if I miss. Um, Boy, I gotta, yeah. I'm gonna right give you, yeah, I'm yeah. gonna give you, no, it's it's over near her. Yeah. Mm. No, um, it's not. If he's chucking like that, it's going towards herbs. It's so, I'm it's, going <laughs> it's like doing this. It's like doing this, right? <laughs> oh. it, no, it isn't. You said it was going up. It's going up. Yes. You said it was going up out of the, out of the hangar bay, so which means I'm that if assuming, he throws and misses, it's herbs. I'm assuming it it'll think land I think like it right is. here. It depends somewhere. on where he hits it. No, this is what, like, so here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna throw. And if I hit it, it's going to explode on the thing. It's going to do damage to the armor. If I miss, it's going to bounce off of it. Like he got the timing Throw wrong. it, bounce it, just... And it's going to fall to the floor. Super ball it. Ooh. Where does it fall? Does it fall to I me? I don't know. Super ball. Or does it fall to you? Let's roll it. How do we determine this? Let's flip, roll it. Flip a coin. Flip, yeah. yeah, a 2D a one. A 1D one <laughs> two. I have, I, have, I have a coin with a head and a tail. First, let's see if it hits. Okay. I still don't trust you. <laughs> it misses. All right. Roll the four. Uh, Got any cards? 
No, initiative cards. I like out. helping the team too. <laughs> All right. So now, where does it fall? So All he pulls right, a grenade be random. and he throws it. He throws a little too hard, too fast, and it bings <laughs> off the droid. Like the the pilot sees a grenade come, he's like, "Fuck!" and it bing, <laughs> falls. <laughs> Falls onto the side. Um, <laughs> All right. Now it's falling. Let me let me do the honors. All right. All right. So Q and C is me. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Blank side. It falls to Amy. Okay. All right. We both need to make an athletics check. Oh God. Of Fifteen. Oof. To not take this damage. Okay. No I I wish it was me though, because <laughs> I think All right. All right. Sorry, Amy. Oh my God! You did not flip that right. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's fine. I, I mean, I saw you flick it. It didn't go ideally satisfying. How many times did it enough? rotate? It needs to go up and then get caught and flipped over. I got a seventeen. Seventeen. All right. So as do me, do me one How more. How good is that? No, that was hers. That was hers. Yeah. So that was my athletics roll. Uh, so my you move is, out of the way. My question is, do I get my drone in time? Now we roll for your drone. Um, what do I? How do I roll that? The same. Uh, let's get. Is it athletics. my athletics? No, 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 what? no. Let's do. Uh, Thank you. Vehicle aircraft. I'll give you vehicle aircraft for fifteen. Ooh. If you can you move it quickly. It. Oh, that sucked. Can somebody inspire my? Yes, yes. 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 I want her to be mysterious. God oh, damn it! Damn it. That one, she yeah. Amy. Does Can I get a card? Yes. <laughs> She's that's never gonna be mysterious. After making a skill or attack roll. That's okay, because I was gonna make you fail that anyway. Oh. <laughs> I was spending all my money to get another drone. <laughs> so now there are no drones for you. Here. I want a doggy next time. We'll, we'll see, because I have to <laughs> roll a three to eight on this, and the drone What's has a say? nine or a nine. ten. It, it's an AC of fourteen, and uh, nine hit points. Three d eight. Let's see it. Does it overcome its AC though? Because the grenade yeah. doesn't. Yes. Okay. Ooh, yeah, it demolishes the drone. How many hit points did it take? Uh, 14 plus Ooh, three, yeah. 17. Yeah, that's definitely it. But that's not double it, so it's not a true death. <laughs> you're gonna, you're gonna revive your drone. Your Here's drone's gone. Question. It's gone. It's gone. I can totally see her hauling it and hauling it into the back of the truck and and, and working I'll let on you it back in the lab. In your downtime. Well, yeah, it's either that or I'm gonna get a dog in my downtime. Uh, I mean, what do you want? That's you want up to you. A synth dog, you uh, can those definitely. Those dogs are pretty dog. brutal in the elevator. They almost yeah. killed you. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Those dogs are pretty ugly. I may trade in for a dog. But I'm taking my drone home for now. <laughs> All right. There we go. So, um, the drone Boy, that is was gone. <laughs> Yeah, that was actually pretty harrowing. <laughs> we all shed a tear. At the end of this is going to be a little like in remembrance little buddy, of little buddy. Little buddy. <laughs> My tear well, he's is not oil. dead. You can bring him. You can bring him back. Uh, I could also probably spare parts of the other one. And, yeah. Oh, there's nothing left of the other one. It was just a. Sh- it was a shooting. It. 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 it oh, it crashed into yeah. the wall and exploded. Yeah, in dramatic fashion because I had to play it up because I had a crowd. I don't um, know. I, can, I think I could pull a, a rotor off of there and get you some. You know, a little. Propeller on your shoulder. I would no, love no, to fly. No, no, a lot of propeller hat. You're up, Monium, and there's one person on the other side from you at three quarter cover. Um, vengeance. Deja's closing in fast behind. I, I, I like all... calms you. I'm like vengeance. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get all 30 feet out so I can try and remove as much as that cover. Would I be able to if I kept going out? 25, 30. Right here is half cover. Um, five, ten. 15, 20, 25, 30, yeah. Okay, after hearing vengeance, I'm running out that full <laughs> cover. Vengeance! And I'm gonna... Yeah, it's not disadvantage, it just adds to his AC. Yeah, right? it's yeah. just half, so he gets a plus two. Huh. Oh. Yeah, 24 yeah, that total. Hits. That hits. Yes! And uh, my eyes blink as they record after hearing vengeance, because I know why. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the first shot fires off. Eight total. Eight. And it connects. Um, it takes him down to kind of like a limp shoulder shot. You you nailed him, um, and you pull it up with the second. Yes. All right. That looked painful. Crap. Uh, Seventeen. Sixteen. Sixteen. <laughs> Sixteen hits. I Even forgot. Even with the half cover. I forgot it was a five. Sixteen. One D. Ooh. Six. After making an attack roll, minus what? Sixteen minus what? Let's see it. Ooh. Four. 12. Twelve. Twelve does not hit. Damn it. Damn you. You're, you're, you're just prolonging his agony, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you're doing. 
thinking of, he's having flashbacks. He's wasted he's, 150,000 yeah. long longs on that grenade. I know. Throw. He's got to be like, oh. <laughs> it must have been satisfying to watch the drone perish, though. <laughs> Um, it's it's got to it's has to be satisfying. It's the last thing he's gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> um, Herbs is gonna use his action to communicate to uh, the driver, uh, Mick, and tell him to move his fucking ass. <laughs> um, what the hell is? Go it go, go 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 go! <laughs> I'm being holed up. I'm number six in the queue. Anyway, um, and he's crouched down. He's full cover, um, and it is Kai's go. Wait, um, I didn't go. You didn't go? Yeah. Monium. Uh, Monium went, then you go. I'm sorry. It's all right. I mean, I'm going to shoot him. All right. <laughs> and, she, and he should have no cover from me. Right in the back. He turns around and sees a giant shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> Monium's eyes play to yeah. record. He takes that <laughs> thing and he looks up at the point of your shotgun. 21. 21? <gasps> what is on that? an attack roll. Oh! Can I un can I undo that N to roll again? No, no, no. No, I can't outplay the Nord Games luck deck. <laughs> we do we, we do it all the time. <laughs> what are you talking about? Um, so how does that work? Um, you're coming. The explosion of the grenade kind of rattles me rattles a little you bit. slightly as you miss a point blank shot, but you still have movement. This is bullshit. <laughs> um. No, I'm not going to use it. I'm not going anywhere. Like, fuck. <laughs> um, oh, you were going to get it. Okay, so I, however much movement it takes me to get all the way around here. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I don't know you can just right go next through there. the 30, tiny little trick. Um, can I, can, I can't <laughs> pull and shoot, can I? I can't do the same thing. That should be part of yeah, the yeah, same. Yeah, you can draw but a weapon as part, part of the, the, the movement. All right, so yeah. I'm going to pull my shotgun. Get out! <laughs> wow. I keep forgetting that you got Next not one fucking in. twenty. <laughs> <laughs> Give us that card. Vengeance is mine. I definitely record that. <laughs> I don't know. You see, so like, come up with oh, fire oh, in her face. Oh. <laughs> what is that? AFV will love this. Twelve after making a saving throw. Yeah. All right. Okay, so then that would have been useful a second. So again. you're recording this. Yes, I am. So it's a twenty. Eyes blink. So it's actually forty-eight. Yes. I think he's dead. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh. I don't even know the numbers. Sixteen. Sixteen plus thirteen <laughs> is what? Is Sixteen to twenty-nine. Is this guy? Twenty-nine. What happens? No. Obliterate him. It's like a key blast, Dragon Ball Z. It's yeah. <laughs> if you will give me a little dramatic license, I just keep unloading my gun into him, screaming, You killed my little buddy, you killed my little buddy, you're gonna pay, you're gonna pay, and just right up to him, just keep walking, keep shooting, and tears, I'm angry, and then I kick him, and then I'm finally done. <laughs> so you need to take a level and die mo. Yeah. So it's blam, blam, click. Click. You, my buddy, just click. Wait, 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 wait. Which, which, which shotgun do you have? Because you should. I mean, mine has six oh. shots. Oh my. I don't know. Whatever. You never use it before. Yeah, you fire shotgun. six shots at it. Yeah, that's fine. I'll mark six off. Very angry. Uh, yeah, you took a spray. You're empty, and you just. Herbs peeks up from his full mm -hmm. cover to look over at like you, the bloodlust. I'm also here. screaming, I want a dog now. Somebody <laughs> buy me a dog. <laughs> and I, I'm just watching, like impressed, like. And Mick is looking think. out of the side of the window. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I didn't think you had it in you. Well done. It's for the animals. <laughs> I like the, the, the little animal. mechanical animals. <laughs> the synths are escaping. It's like really happy for them in the seat. <laughs> 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 oh right. And as a mindless that drone. happens, <laughs> you shoot. see it turn yeah. and it makes its way. Yeah, off they're like people. From I don't Mars. Know. <laughs> um, knowing that um, you're out of combat, but you do know that you've downed. Um, a reclamation team, an SFPD mech. We gotta go. And a drone. Yeah. Uh, let's scuttle anything that do we has recordings. Yes. And do we want to pull any pieces off and see if we can use them? Sure. I mean, we should at least take the memory if you can find the memory card. And, and the CPU off of both drones. And like fucking just yeah. break it under my heel or something. Bury it in the truck and destroy the truck. That's a suggestion. So you guys... Do we need the truck to get into Yeah, we need to get out of here. Never mind. Burrito Yes, kill? I yeah, need to go get burritos. I need a burrito pickup after this. I'm a little tired. <laughs> totally I, I understandable. Need, I need some sleep after this. I don't know what you're on about. 
So, um, uh, what are you? What are you doing? Herbs is running down the stairs frantically into the car. Let's get the fuck out of here. So Where? I comes to you and be like, get the memory card and the CPU out of yeah, the I'll other get, drone. I'll grab I'm whatever gonna, I can out of it. I'm gonna pick up whatever I can out of my drone and I'm gonna get the car. Are you gonna like haul the drone into the truck? Yeah. Do we your, want your wrecked drone? Your, yeah. What's left of it? Yeah, might as well. Okay. Uh, do we want to try and pull anything off of like the mechs or anything like that? Do we have time? I'm gonna help. If we do have time, I'm gonna help Ryoga decipher what's useful. Did did that guy have any other grenades on him? Oh, good no. question. <laughs> <laughs> does, does anyone have a cop pistol? Uh, so are we investigating? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, we're, we're gonna loot the bodies. Do it. All right. So the VR veteran has a heavy pistol. It's 2d6. Okay. Uh, and a combat shotgun, which is 3d8. That's, uh, that, 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 that's the same as what I have. Mm -hmm. The other Merc has a grenade. Dibs. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hold on, we'll just someone who's got the better athletics. Just just a, a uh, I have a plus five to my athletics. I also want to get my flashlight. <laughs> you That's see, outside. The is outside. It's gotta have some. So you have to remember to pick way. it up on the yeah, way. Yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, <laughs> let's wait. Park. Pull over. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's just grab what we can. We'll figure out who gets what later. Okay, sounds good. Um, so you are <laughs> able to pull what you know to be a um, a memory mm -hmm. chip from it. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, you know that it's been transmitting this entire time. Damn it. I mean, it's not like they don't. It's not like we're not on the most wanted list. So. Yeah. Right. They also know what kind of truck we're in. That's the problem. That's why I thought we should destroy it. Well, is there any other vehicle to get us out of here? It doesn't matter. I mean, can we disguise we're... this vehicle? Problem. Let's get out first because so, remember the cops were on their way down. That, that was a lot of loud noises and banging, with the exception of the explosion. Nothing is out of place though because it is air traffic. It's very loud. Um, but the explosion kind of. It, it's all been internal. The mm -hmm. only opening was um, in the roof. Um, the people are kind of milling around, thinking something's up, and no one's really. L let's alarmed. load everything into the back of this, into the back of the truck, and drive out of here. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a hangar adjacent to you that might have a car in. You do. They might have a what? Car. A car. Well, we're, we want to take the truck, don't we? Well, unless we want to leave behind this vehicle so we can get away more uh, discreetly. Uh, mm -hmm. Somebody somebody grab that car. We're gonna drive this out of here with all the bodies. We're gonna dump all the bodies and the truck. What? In the bay? Yeah. I don't know, your lease is over here probably. It definitely is. I am oh, not paying it. shit. Sorry, you, man. Yeah. How about Herbs can take the bodies, hide that part, and we can run with the other vehicle, if you are okay with that. Preferably. Where are you gonna go? <sighs> Where are we gonna go? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. We should have maybe gone on the uh, <laughs> transport. I'm not going back to Mars. Well, we have Look, to, uh, I'll die mm. first. It's not that bad. Frisco's finest you is in the Badlands. Is it? It's oh, oh perfect. It's okay. outside of the city. Yeah. I mean, while it's... the making's hot, I say we... We go, yeah. We go. <sighs> Leave the other truck behind. Honestly, if, if if we if we use the truck, we may have enough time to use it to get in. Mm -hmm. They're gonna be they're gonna be hot with drones after this, and that place can is we, on high alert probably. Can we remote control the car? We so we can get a diversion. Two Perfect. vehicles leaving at the same time. And I'll, and if we can remote control it, we can also crash into a wall can, somewhere can there. Do it? I don't know. Can I do it? We don't have much time. Their cops are coming. We Tesla. saw we saw we saw them testing. <laughs> Uh, technology <clears throat> check. It could be, or would a car be a hack mech? Uh, so I'm gonna give you a technology check to see. Well, that sucks. You keep rolling fives I know. tonight. I, I, I should have said a helper, but. Oh, <laughs> the help action. I was about to. Do you guys want to inspire it? Yeah. 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 Do it. Chip him. Yeah, because that's like eight. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll try it again. Can I help her with this one? Different dice, yeah. maybe? So um, I'm help her yeah, you can, yeah, you can roll with it too. Yikes. Yeah, okay. That's not any better. Well, he, he he's, he's taking the help action to, to give her advantage. So I have 10. And? Advantage? OK, so let me roll some more. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Technology, wait, wait. or is it? Tech. tech. It's tech. Tech, uh, 16. 16, OK, mm -hmm. so you are able to help her identify and jerry-rig some way to rudimentary mm -hmm. accelerate and steer this thing, if you want to use that at some point. Sure. All right, so. 
we get the two vehicles out of here at the same time. We all get into the other vehicle and drive this thing and, and drive the truck into the wall to draw things elsewhere while we go in while we go in a different door. Really? As opposed to using stealth, but no, using the truck to just get in as a delivery vehicle. I say we just use the truck to get the fuck out of here. Let's and get if out. we need yeah. a diversion at the gates of Frisco's finest, then we control the truck. Yep. We roll it into a whatever chemical Sure, we'll vat sure. burritos are made. Sure, why not? That we'll blow works. up something else. Yeah. There's <laughs> definitely a chemical vat or chemical vat around here somewhere. There's gotta be. All right, everyone in, I'm driving. Oh, shit, okay. Uh, Herb's just running down, uh, hops into the passenger side. The shotgun seat? Yeah, shotgun seat. <laughs> As nice. you toss him your shotgun, he's like, Jesus Christ! <laughs> he looks at you. Don't shoot yourself. He'll, Don't go over any bumps! <laughs> um, and we make our way out of the hangar, tires burning, not stopping for lights, mm -hmm. no one. We are heading off and into I'm, the and, darkness and, of the badlands. And I mean, as soon as as soon as we're out of like the main conglomerated area, I turn off the headlights and drive and drive dark. Oh Jesus! <laughs> Herbs closes his eyes because I have dark vision and That's can right. do that. <laughs> That's Fragile true. Shotgun. Wormers get dark vision because of their tough upbringing on Mars. Um, doesn't it give you solace to know that Frisco's finest is? Manufactured in the Badlands, right? Where? All yeah. kinds of irradiation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I will never eat from there again. No. All right, and that's where we're going to leave it today. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching yeah. us escape this. Um, I thought for sure that that was going to be tougher than it was. I should have put more reclaimers in there, but I thought that 60 HP and 16 AC without cover is more than enough, but prove me wrong again. Um, thankfully, though, no real loops and left turns in terms of storyline arc. You guys <laughs> didn't follow some random person off to the side. <laughs> We'd all get on the transport and be like, we're wanting people out of, out of here. <laughs> It's like, how do I keep you guys from not going to Mars with the cargo ship? <laughs> yeah, I was, I was tempted, but then I was yeah. like, De Deja would die before yeah, she goes Mars. back to, to Mars. Mars. I love was... you, poem girl. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot to get her name. Did you say that? No, oh, oh, damn it. <laughs> I'll bing it. So, join us next week, hopefully for the exciting conclusion of our saga of Interlinked, um, which is Carbon 2185's newest release mission book. I'd like to thank our community so much. We're amazing. Nick, thank you so much for gifting subs. Congratulations to our winner, and thank you guys winners. so much. Yep. Winners. We yep. had two yes. winners today. We had and a lot of Congratulations, Hef, for just yeah. being you. Yeah, yeah. no. <laughs> thank, thank you, Hef. Happy half day, Hef day. And thank you, Baroness, for running the show. Absolutely. Seriously, yes. thank you so much, m'lady. Um, and hope to see you same time next week. Bye. We can't do that. You can't do that one today, at least. <laughs> <laughs>